You know what? I didn't actually test the volume to see if this was like too loud or if my voice is too loud or whatever. But hey, how's it going? It's uh, it's me, that guy, the weed dude, and stuff. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So uh, I'm uh, I'm doing a like a new thing now, um, where I figured, hey, you know, let's um. Let's let's do YouTube and Twitch at the same time. Apparently, you can do that. Um, so I'm I'm doing that, um, and I I have a thingy set up here on my little stream, and it tells me if anybody's chatting to me on YouTube. But I haven't seen any messages on Twitch yet. Let's see. I don't know if anybody's just like not messaging me on Twitch or if it's not working. No, I think no. I think I think literally nobody just said anything on Twitch. Okay, that's cool. So yeah, uh, welcome, Sparkly Mop and Evan and Mr. Needle Mouse and Sparkly Mop again <laughs> and Top Sauce. Um, Elpe, <laughs> I'm just gonna I'm just gonna call you Elpe. Uh, Primo and keep the beat sneefing over here. Thank you, thank you. It is it is good to be back, and um, yeah, you know, I just I I wanted to. Oh, there we go. Now I got a message on Twitch. Hello, cowboy SG. Okay, cool. So so it does work. All right, awesome. All right. Um, so yeah, I actually wanted to do this on the same day um, that I uploaded the you know the the, the update video, April Fools, um, and I like I got up. And I started to, hang on, this is actually, this is a smidge loud. <laughs> I, I, I woke up with a little bit of a headache t this morning, so that might be why. Um, <clears throat> um, I woke up and um, I, I think I mentioned in the update video that my sleep schedule is all screwed up because I recorded, it was like 2 a.m. in the morning. Um, and uh, I woke up in like the afternoon and um, I said, you know what, I, I want to, I want to stream. Let's stream. Um, also, thank you for the follow, Lemon. Thank you, thank you. Um, and I got everything. I, I set everything back up. Like I had to, you know, get all the little updates and and you know and, and set all the things back up to the way that I had it, want it, set it and stuff and blah blah. And um, and then after I was done, I was so tired. <laughs> I just went back to sleep. Um, so that's that's how that happened the other day. Um, and then I, I wanted to try again yesterday. And I was just like, man, I'm just I'm really not feeling it. I, I don't think I should stream when I'm not feeling it. So I didn't. Um, and so here we are, uh, third attempt, and uh, doing it. Alrighty. So hello the TC. Hello Chris. I'm uh, yeah I'm doing okay. Cade Williams. How's it going? Um, and Gimbo Sliced, I remember you from YouTube like 15 years ago. Yeah, it, it has been that long, actually. That's when uh, that's when I was actually doing uh, um, Mario Kart Wii. Plan for this stream. Um, so it's been l a very long time since I streamed. Um, I wanted to, you know, kind of ease into something easy. Um, <clears throat> and, uh, I really enjoy, for the past ten years, have been playing Minecraft, 
and uh, you know it's got some new updates and stuff and I got a whole bunch of mods for it and uh, you know I kind of I kind of wanted to do that it's always a lot of fun you know for me like when you know, the, like the very beginning of that adventure you know you're just kind of like there's there's a lot of new stuff now because of the mods that I added so <clears throat> oh so, what is that super chat oh thank you so much Evan been watching you since 2000. Thank you. I hope you're doing well. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Evan. I really appreciate the five. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Also, I have to clear my throat. Okay, we're all set. <laughs> I just I wanted to mute my mic for that because I didn't I didn't want to you know destroy you guys' ears for that. Um, my my life is average. <laughs> Readings were peak. Oh my god, yes. It's it's sad what happened to that website. It, it was a, it was a fun fun website. Also, I uh, just had myself some coffee. It's a me, coffeeo. Uh, I can never join because I had no Wii. Oh, for Mario Kart Wii. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I was like, wait, what are we talking about? <laughs> I just I just talked about like three things at once, and my ADHD is very bad, so I very. I have a tendency to forget things from, like, topic to topic, and I was like, wait, what were we just talking about? Alright, so let's go and switch over to this. Um, so I, I kind of wanted, like, I made, like, a couple of, uh, worlds, uh, in anticipation of this. Brine Shrimp and Volcano Season. Um, but I kind of wanted to make another new one, and I just kind of wanted to, like... I don't know, I just, I just, I love that feeling of just, like, doing a brand new run. And, you know, just kind of like, you know, hey, where am I? You know, let me look around and stuff like that. So I'm gonna, oh, whoops, I clicked the wrong thing. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Um, like I said, I have, like, a ton of mods. I have, uh, how many? 113. <laughs> 113. And I'm gonna be playing on, uh, version 120.1 here. Um, I actually wanted to do this, recreate. <laughs> yes, I know. Bad, bad memory, bros. Bad memory, bros. Also, I did see. You know what? I actually just remembered. Um, somebody mentioned mittens. She's right here. Yes. Hello, cat. Oh, can you guys oh no. Let go. <laughs> Say hello to all the nice people. Hello. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> pet mittens, pet mittens, pet mittens, pet mittens. <laughs> She's like, what am I doing here? Dear God, let me go. Yeah, what's up here? Yeah, what is that? Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> Alrighty. Alrighty. Um, okay. So, all of the uh, world names, I, I know they, they look like completely random nonsense, they're actually, um, I, I'm such a fan of Space Ghost, Coast to Coast, that I literally, I, I think it was like a couple of years ago, I started making world names after, like, quotes from the show. Um, so now I gotta think of a new one. Uh, but in the meantime, let me make sure that, yeah, new seed, all these things should be good. I do have it in a little bit of baby mode. I don't like the freeze damage, that's really obnoxious. Um... What was the other thing? I don't want the uh, pillager patrols. Yeah, that's nonsense. I hate that so much. Uh, wardens, I'm turning that off for right now. Because, uh, well, you know, they're freaky. And uh, what was the other thing? I don't even remember. What, whatever, it's not a big deal. Um, <coughs> oh, you remember that show? Nice. Uh, <coughs> I know, it's, it's, <coughs> it's genuinely one of my like two favorite shows. And that, and uh, Burn Notice, and I know I mentioned Burn Notice a number of times in Mario Kart Wii series, and I, um, when I was doing the TF2 battles, I remember um, <clears throat> I had my name as Michael Weston for a while. Um, let's see, thinking of a Space Ghost episode. Okay, let's see. Um, how about um, the Bobcat episode? Um, how about... Hey Mo, I'm a, hey Mo, I'm a replicant. Nah, 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 nah. Replicants are the evil creation of Doctor Zen. So we'll do that one, Doctor Zen. Peaceful, yeah, it's going peaceful for now. So let's go ahead and do that. Bologna sandwich. Oh my God, Brax bologna sandwich. 
Well, first of all, that was from Cartoon Planet. And second of all, that also lives rent-free in my head, and I've made that sandwich a number of times. It's, um... It was made with fresh beef bologna that mom bought yesterday. It had butter and American cheese on white bread, boy oh boy. Slap a little brown mustard on top, and buddy, you're full of joy. It's, I, I don't know why, but it is a delicious sandwich, and I enjoy eating it. It is a good one. Yeah, that is a, a sweet baby. You didn't sit... Oh, no, it wasn't Brack. Brack... Oh, no, Brack did sit on it. That's right. He thought it was uh, somebody else. He thought it was... Um... Oh, God, what were their names? Somebody stole my baloney sandwich on the bus to school. Was it Bob or Billy or Fred? Oh, buddy, them boys is cruel. There's some... Wait a minute, I'm, I'm sitting on it. Oh, man. I'm sorry, sandwich. Oh, okay. Oh, snow. Okay. All right. This is actually very, uh, very, uh, 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 good music. I couldn't think of the word. Very, uh, good music for this, uh, opening moment here. What is that? I think the only song that I remember is... Oh, don't touch me! You know, I actually had those CDs. Well, the, actually the second CD, which had those songs on it. The Bologna Sandwich and Don't Touch Me and Highway 40, you know. It was, uh, what was it? Space Ghost Surf and Turf. I think I, I actually still have it around here somewhere. I, I, I never get rid of anything. Oh, what's going on here? What is this? It's like a, oh? Safe Haven find a tavern. Okay, cool, cool. Oh, this is, oh, this is pretty. Oh, there's a, hi, how you doing? Michalina, a nitwit. That sells things. That's not normal, but wow. Okay, wow. Huh. Okay. <laughs> this makes me feel so old. What mod is this? Well, I don't, Oh, wow, look, there's a little, uh, snow golem. Um, I don't know what mod added this. Uh, wow, this is really nice. This is, wow, this is, this is a house. This is a, oh. Ooh. Got glowberries and bread and potatoes. Okay. Okay, yeah, I'm kind of feeling this. Yeah, this is, this is cool. Okay. There's a, a mushroom here for some reason. And then there you got this going on here, and then you got, uh, what is, what is this? Oh, oh god. I need to click on that. Oh, oh wow, cool candles and little sleepy places. Oh, okay, cool. It's like little rooms. I'll take this one. Oh, oh god. Wow, this is, this is cool. Does it have a second, it looked like it had a second floor. How do I get to the second floor? Oh, here we go. More hay bales. And the... Hi? How you doing? Oh, okay. Alright, you keep... You know, you keep on doing what you're doing. I'll just I'll close the door. Another chest up here. Ooh, fancy. Call for adventure. What is that? A tavern quest map. Oh, cool. Look at that. Jungle... Oh, it's supplementaries that adds this. Okay, cool. Huh. This is cool, yeah. Uh, you know, I don't have any of those mods that add, like, terrifying stuff to the game, like Fire and Ice and, like, Mousy's Mobs and stuff. I... No. I, um... One of my friends, you know, Mboysen, I've done um, a few videos with them. Um, most... I think... I feel like most notably the um, Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door playthrough. Um, and... Um, he started up a server and and put like a like a ton of mods and it was a 1.12 server and it had like fire and ice and it had mousy's mobs and and the uh, un fishes undead rising and i i swear to god after like a day or two i was like can you please like turn these mods off i don't want to deal with this <laughs> please 
I yeah, I mean, hey, I didn't know he was sleeping in there. I, I didn't hear any snoring. You know, there was there was no you know no 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 sign on the door. The door wasn't locked. You know, that would be freaky if there was a locked door mod in Minecraft. I think I'd, I'd freak out. I'd be like, why isn't this door opening? Oh, I'm just gonna break the wall. <laughs> Screw it. Is this is this Gunbound? What song is this? Want more? What is this? Oh, this is from Nas Tail. Yep, from Nas Tail. Oh, I love I love Nas Tail's music. I really didn't play it that much, but it's it's got such funky music. Hey, how's it going, bud? Oh, there's a nice view you got here. Yes, yes indeed. How's it going? Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. I want you to acknowledge my. EXISTENCE! <laughs> Sorry, I got really in the moment there. Oh, okay. Oh, yes. Yes, now you see me. Yes. I live here. I live here! Me! Me! Yeah, you better walk away. Jerk. <laughs> and I, I pounded on the desk and it, it made the little uh, the flap that goes over the camera come down. <laughs> All right, gotta close the door. That's important. We don't want any monsters getting in. All right, that, this is cool. You know, it's got like a little campfire and um, whatever this is going on here. I guess this is like a trough for like horses or something. Oh, look at this. I'm. Am I? Oh, I thought I was sinking. Oh, I guess it's just a little uh, snow, snow block, half snow block. Oh, hey, there's another one, Cedric. What's up, Cedric? And we got this. What is this? Is this... Is this supposed to be like a freezer or something? Or is there something like hidden, like in the igloos? Oh, shoot. I just remembered. I didn't get the friggin' crap. I didn't get my bonus stuff. Minus with the great pumpkin. I know you're referencing the peanuts, but I don't know what that's from exactly. I assume it's some sort of like Halloween peanuts thing. Um, dear god, where did I start? It was all the way over here, wasn't it? Oh, I also have it set so that it doesn't advance the time of day, so it'll always look like this. Oh, here we go. Neat. What all did I get? I got some, oh, the whoopee cushion. That makes you fart. I love how, you know, I've actually had... What is this mod? Artifacts. I've had it for ages. And um, I never actually used the whoopee cushion because I knew it was just a, a goofy, like, you know, jokey, non-useful thing. But only recently did I actually put the whoopee cushion on and see what it does. So I'm just going to pause my music for a sec so you guys can hear this. Or... Oh, wait, I think maybe this is the wrong slot. Is it... Is it doing it? I don't hear it. Weird. Okay. <laughs> wait a minute. It did it the other day. Okay, I guess it just doesn't want to do it anymore. Oh, wait, it, it is. It it does say it's coming up. It, I just saw it in the caption. It just says fart. I don't hear it, though. Oh, now I hear it. <laughs> it's so quiet. Why is it so quiet? That's weird. It's a lot quieter than it was before. This is Metroid Prime. How long is Metroid Prime? Is this the real Minecraft Part 1 and not April Fool's Super Mario 64? Okay, first of all, you get a an internet cookie for remembering that that was it was named that. Um, and second of all, oh my god, see this is why I have it off. This is literally why I have it off. I hate this so much, this is so obnoxious. Uh, second of all, it, it, it is. Shale. Interesting. 
Um, I'm gonna be in a little bit of trouble here. I didn't I didn't get an axe for some reason or a shovel. A little gravel. I mean gravel. No, 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 no. Bad snow. No. We don't do that here. Haven't seen this channel since the Paper Mario played. That was 2012, wasn't it? Good god. That was a while ago. You know what's funny? Um The other day I was actually thinking about uh Paper Mario. And I was thinking about like doing a uh, a long play cuz you know I haven't done one of those in a while. And uh I was like, "Man, maybe I could do like a long play for Paper Mario or something." And then I and then I thought Wait a minute, didn't I do a Paper Mario pl uh, playthrough? I, I literally didn't even remember that I did that. That's... My, my brain's going. It's just... it's gone. It's so weird, like, I literally have to, like, re-watch that playthrough to, like, remember what I did and what, <laughs> what I was talking about, because I literally do not. Sort that out. Um... I need... A shovel. And... Can I... Hmm, I wonder if I can make, um... If I can use shale as a, uh, Oh, for God's sake. As a, uh... Substitute for steel. Oop, I'm just gonna put that there. Let's find out. Boop, boop. Pickaxe. Oh my God! Okay, cool. Easy peasy. Cool, I'll make a shovel out of that too. Do 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 do. Paper Mario playthroughs is on my top five. You know, I, I hate the sinking in the snow. It's, I mean, yeah, it looks like tomfoolery, but the problem is when it's set to vanilla default settings, you start losing health when you're stuck under the snow like that. And it's really, really, really annoying. I can't stay and watch now. I'm glad I'm back. You, blah, blah. Glad you're back and doing better. Well, I'm glad you're back, Magnetech. What do you think of that? But yes, thank you. I appreciate that. Um, then I found Mark Kirby in Super Mario 64. Awesome. Oh, man. See, this is... Mm, Honestly, you know, if if not for the tavern there, I, I actually probably would have restarted this world and, and tried for another seed. I'm not... Mm, not feeling this one. Not feeling it. I also have some other um, mods like Terralith and Tectonic, which are making these... Um, some of these uh, biomes, which usually would not be hilly or mountainous like this. Hilly and mountainous. Also, I always forget to do this. Blood dolphin chills. I never left. Oh, okay. Alright, that's, 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 that's fine too. That's fair. Alrighty. Ooh, is this a spooky cave? How spooky is this cave? Oh. Oh. Hmm. It's, uh, hmm. It's moderately spooky. Yeah, I, hmm. Yeah, it's, um, it's, uh, yeah, fairly spooky, I would say. Not, not, not even, like, moderately. This, this is, like, fairly spooky. Hey, what is up, Jer... Oh, Jeracer X. I'm glad you got out of the situation okay. I've always enjoyed your Sonic 3 and Super Mario Sunshine Places. That's... Now, that's an interesting shout-out. Sonic 3 is not a playthrough that I hear a lot of people mention as, like, you know, their favorites. Or, like, you know, where they started watching or anything. But, yeah, that's, that's awesome. That was, um... That was an interesting playthrough with, uh, Dak, Corey, and Timon. Where, um, <laughs> um, when we got to the, the hydrosity level and Dak 
turn the volume up all the way to max and started screaming when the video started playing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, bunny. A little bunny. Hello, bunny. How you doing? See, this is what this is part this is one of the things that I really like about peaceful is that when you're in peaceful, animals that run away from you do not run away. That I like. I like being one with nature. Yes. Hello. How you doing? Mentally process writing my college paper. Watching a Twitch stream. A streamer I've been watching since middle school. Okay. Welcome, welcome, Coralus. Oh, yes, true. Chemical plant zone, yes. Sunshine may have been the first LP I ever I ever watched. Yeah, th now that's that's a more common one that I get. You know, like I, I still get good lord, look at these mountains. Beautiful. It's beautiful. Um I do get comments every so often still of people like coming to the uh, Super Mario Sunshine playthrough and being like, oh my god, you know, it's been a while. Hey, how you doing? I remember watching this when I was a kid and so on and so forth. And, you know, now I'm in college. I'm like, okay. <laughs> I see. Oh my god, I'm gonna... Yeah. Mm. Please don't sink. Please don't sink. Please don't sink. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah, they um, they've always run. They always run away if the difficulty is in anything other than peaceful. Like if I set the difficulty to easy, like it, it would have just bolted. I am gonna run out of pickaxe probably very quickly doing this. So yeah, yeah, Mario Kart Wii. That's that's a more common one. Super Mario Galaxy Two. Obviously, that was my biggest playthrough. Oh, there's an Anthony on my screen. Hey, Fifi, how's it going? How you doing? I'm back to streaming. Been a while. And, you know, it's weird because I remember, um, I think I did, like, that... Was it... Oh, God. I don't... Actually, no, I don't think I streamed at all when I was in the, the old apartment. I don't think I streamed, like, a single time. Huh. But yeah, here we are. <laughs> I really like racked my brain thinking about that one. Bunny's just vibed. See that? But I mean, that's what I wish they would do. Also, I do have a chocobo mod. We got uh, some gashel greens that kind of pop up every so often. And before anybody asks, no, I do not have the new FF7 Rebirth, um, because I don't have a PS5. Well, I, I think it's on Steam, too, isn't it? I just, I don't know. I, I, mm, I didn't play FF7. I tried to. Good lord, this mountain is huge. Uh, and I just could never get into it. So, like, when the remake came out, I was just like, oh, okay, that's cool. <laughs> you know, I played FF14 quite a bit. And I did streams on that and a, um, a gameplay video on it. Where I remember... Very awkwardly trying to justify the fact that I made a female healer. Yes. I, I feel, you know, and I... <laughs> that still lives rent-free in my head. And honestly, you know, the easier and simpler uh, answer for that was just, I just like it. I just like my character the way that she is. Super Mario Land 2? Yes, that was Super Mario Land 2. This is actually very quiet, but it's Mario's Tennis. Um, the little, uh, like when you first boot it up on the Virtual Boy. And um, I remember every so often they would give you like little, there'd be like little like special tunes. Uh, in the very beginning, like when you boot it up and it gives you like the little warning and it's like, you know, do not play this for too long or whatever. Otherwise, you know, you'll melt your eyeballs and, you know, your, your brain might explode and, you know, you might you might never want to play our, our games again after that, you know. But, I mean, I did. <laughs> I never got headaches playing Virtual Boy. I never did. The only thing was my, uh, my eyes would get kind of um, raw. Like, my, my eyesight would get really raw. So when I, you know, when I... It, it's almost like, you know... 
being in the dark for a long time and then just like walking out into the sunlight like that kind of feeling like when i when i would look away from it after a while of playing <laughs> no this is in mario land 2 music incredible memories watching the wii dude wario land <laughs> wario wears smooth moves oh dear um now that one that that's a funny one that you would bring up because i was thinking about you know, hey, I'm doing stuff on camera now, and I do specifically remember saying during that playthrough, wow, I wish you guys could see how silly I look. Hmm. Well. You never know. Ow. Is that a... I think that's a blazing archwood. And that is a... Oh, um... I was going to take a bunch of damage here. I'm in peaceful anyway, so it's not like it matters that much. Um, that frosty... Oh god, what is it called? Ah, crap, I can't remember. I just remember it has leaves that, that fall down. It looks really pretty. Donkeys! Uh, hello. Oh god. That came out of nowhere. Do 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 do. I've, you know, it's funny, I've never actually been a dog person in Minecraft as well as in real life. I've always ever just wanted, like, a cat pet in Minecraft. So every, every time there was just, like, a wolf or whatever, I'd just be like, oh, okay, hello, dog, bye, dog. Oh, what do we got here? I remember your stuff on... Watched your stuff on my LG Lotus flip phone back in middle school. Wow. That is something. Oh, it's a, um, sp uh, what do they call it? Whirly Sprig. It used to be called a Spriggan, but now they changed it as Whirly Sprig. Hey, hello, friend. These little guys are, are so much fun to interact with. There's, uh, there's three of them. There's the Whirly Sprigs, there's the Starbuncles, and the Drigmies. And they have little, um, they have special requests, essentially. Where the whirly sprig, if you plant a tree and it grows right in front of them, like they have to, they have to be like a fairly short distance away, um, they'll poof away and they'll give you a um, a whirly sprig um, uh, charm. I think it's called charm. And uh, and then yeah, with that you can do other stuff. Oh my god, that is a big frozen lake. Wow, that is nice. Or frozen river, I'd imagine actually, because it's going around the mountains. Nope, that's a lake. All right, cool. LG Lotus flip phone. Oh, man. I used to have a, um... I, was it... I think it was Motorola? It was, a uh, It was a slider phone. I don't know if anybody remembers those. But, like, yeah, it was just, like, you know, a regular cell phone, and then you'd take it and you'd slide it, and it would expose the, the numbers... I, I loved that little phone. I it was red. I remember I bought it, and um, I just loved it to death. Oh my god, what is happening over here? Hello. I'm going in! Oh my god. <laughs> this is... This is cool, but also a little spooky. It's time to, What the... What is that? What is that? Oh, that's... Okay. Oh, it's just... Oh, my God. It's just stones. Oh, my God. I thought that was, like, a, a like a person or something. <laughs> oh, my God. I was literally... I was about to just bolt. 180. Gone. I'm deleting this world and I'm making a new one. <laughs> that was scary. I, th I thought that was a person. I, th I thought it was... Uh, Hero Brian got me. I thought he was getting me. Let's go over to... Hero Brian over here. This is a really big cave. Oh my god, I can't see. I can't see. My, is my brightness up? I always forget to turn it up. Oh, it's not. Okay, cool. Now it is. Okay, so this is Stoon. Oh, thank you, uh, Restream.io. I, I received 100 messages today. Okay, cool. <laughs> I used to uh, slider from the midnight. Midnight Club was such a great game. Um, I used to watch you on my iPod Touch Gen Four. 
That's crazy. When, you know, when those were new, I remember... Okay, I, I'm the innovator of this, so I'm, I, I expect a, um, you know, like a, um, some kind of, uh, yeah, what's the word? Um, dit check, whatever. So, whoa, what the? Um, so, anyway, uh, I, I expect to be paid for the fact that when, like, iPods were new, I remember thinking to myself, or when iPhones were new, I'm sorry. When iPhones were new, I remember thinking to myself, gee, wouldn't it be cool if you could watch live streams on your phone? That would be so cool. Like, I could be out in the... I could be out anywhere. Anywhere. I could be out anywhere. I could be out walking. I could be out at a restaurant. I could be in the bathroom. I could be watching somebody streaming. That would be so awesome. And then, you know, as the years went by, then, you know, uh, Twitch started to expand into, you know, mobile, um, and stuff like that. Like, this, this was the era when I was streaming on that one website. Um... Wasn't it called Livestream.com or something? Have you ever considered saving some ladies for the rest of us? <sighs> okay, fine. Oh, I will. Since you asked so nicely, and we're very generous with that donation. Thank you so much, Nave. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you! Thank you. <laughs> I, I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm just kind of... I'm just, I, mm. oh, I should have farmed that, I have a stone pickaxe, why didn't I farm the iron, uh, I'm so busy talking, I can't talk and do stuff at the same time, it's like impossible, oh, I found the other way out though, <laughs> I was indeed talking to a rock, that was, I mean, that, that genuinely scared me. I thought that was like a, like an enemy or like a, a something, an entity, whatever. I, I was, I, I'm, I'm not kidding. I was literally about to like close the world and, and like delete it and make a new one. <laughs> like if, if that thing turned out to not be a rock and it just started like moving towards me, then yeah, I would have, I would have screamed. Relationships. I remember when I uploaded this song to Weekend Music, and I heard the goofiest lyrics ever, and I said, gee, I wonder if anybody else hears goofy lyrics too. Why don't you guys leave a comment and tell me what goofy lyrics you guys hear? And I remember somebody being like, that's not cool. But I mean... <sighs> It, it's what I heard. It was it was goofy. When did Minecraft become a horror game? It's been a horror game. Minecraft. Listen, I I can't play horror games because Minecraft is enough of a horror game for me to deal with. I will never forget the time when I was playing by myself. And, you know, on a single player world. Oh, Nave, my god, another five. Good lord! Uh, thank you so much, Nave! You're the first person I ever subbed to back in 09, inspired me to make videos. What or who inspired you? Um. Hellfire comms. Hellfire comms. was like the. the real, like, turning point that made me say, you know what, I actually, I actually do want to do this. Because I remember when I was a little kid, before YouTube even existed, I would literally play video games. I'd be sitting there with my friends, I'd be playing video games, and I would record ourselves playing these video games with a cassette tape. And, you know, like, we'd be, we'd be, like, talking, and, you know, you know, cracking jokes, and, you know, you know, talking about dumb kid stuff. But, like, yeah, I, I, it was something that I had been interested in since way before YouTube even existed. Um, and then when I saw, I, I don't know if Hellfire Comes was the first LPR I ever, uh, watched, but I do distinctly remember watching the, um, the Sonic Adventure 2 battle playthrough that they did, 
and just thinking like, man, I could do this. Like that, this would be so much fun. Like I, I could play Sonic Adventure 2 as well, and you know, and, and gab around, and and you know, and and you know, play and, and show how good I am at video game. Yeah, me, I'm good video game person, man. And I'm, you know, I'm, I feel like I'm average compared to most, especially nowadays. You know, I'm, I'm old and over the hill, but um. But yeah, it was it was a lot of fun and something that I definitely wanted to get into. Oh dear God, it's all right. Despite how little I have paid attention to um, making videos and streaming over the you know recent years, um, it it is something that I always think about. I mean, genuinely, I, I don't think there's a single day that goes by where I'm like, God, you know, my YouTube channel, you know, oh my God, I could, you know. You know, I, I got this playthrough going, and you know, oh man, I could do, you know, oh I just got this game, man, I could do, I could do a gameplay on this, and you know, give my like my first impressions on it and stuff, and then I'll either not do that, or I will literally let that game sit in like my Steam library or something uh, until I actually do get around to actually making a video on it. Sonic Adventure One DX playthrough would be interesting. Um, me still trying to figure out the lyrics to track on Ford Racing Three for damn near twenty years. I have no idea what you're talking about. Um, Sonic Adventure One. Uh, I played that all the way through. Um, because you know I never had a Dreamcast, but when it came out on GameCube, I was like, I. <laughs> All of a sudden, I was like, hey, I, I'm a Sonic fan, too. Yes, I have always been a Sonic fan. Yes, indeed. Mm -hmm. um, but, I mean, really, I, I did. I had friends that had, you know, Sega Genesis. And um, I think I had, like, one friend that had, like, a Sega Saturn. And then, like, a couple friends that had Dreamcast. And, you know, I, I actually would play Sonic quite a bit, you know, when I was at somebody else's house. But, um... Uh, when when it came to Nintendo, I was just like, man, I got to get every song in the game now, <laughs> and so I did. I, and I got Sonic Adventure One DX, and I played it all the way through, and it was fun. But a uh, chocobos. Um. Oh, oh okay. Sorry. Um, <laughs> the controls for it are not great, and it is very buggy, and buggy and and buggy <laughs> that was like that was like the one thing that I really remember playing it again on Skype many years later with deck um, like the two of us we, we were like we would screen share on Skype and we would like play it together and I just remember just eating so many glitches just phasing through the wall and homing attacks just shooting off to nowhere and um um god what else uh I don't I don't just I don't know just random buggy crap I can't even think right now oh god my head oh my head still wish I had my dad's old Dreamcast um that would be awesome honestly Dreamcast was such a fantastic console and it was so ahead of its time it's it's crazy to me it is crazy to me how much innovation sega did with that damn console and the sad thing is it was too little too late because when you look back on history um i'm gonna shout out a youtube channel here real quick I'm sure at least a, at least a few people already know about this channel because it's very big. The Gaming Historian. If you watch those videos on um, Super Mario Bros. 3 and Super Mario World, he does go into discussion about Sega and, you know, their competition um, that they posed for Nintendo. And it was so odd reliving that because oh and the Mario Paint uh, video that he did because Sega despite their big wigs despite their you know their top guys 
going, oh, you know, we're ahead of the game and Nintendo has to play catch up with us and, you know, we're, we're not worried about Nintendo. They ended up copying Nintendo so much that they were always that one step behind Nintendo. And it, it was crazy to think about that and, and, you know, come to that realization, like, Sega wasn't that innovative. And, it, like, they literally made Sonic in response to Mario, because Mario was a humongous figure in the video gaming uh, continuum. Sold absolutely tons of, of, uh, of, of games, merchandise, you know, sponsorships. There was the movie. There was cereals. There was, like, macaroni and cheese with Mario. Um, there was, you know, bedspreads and posters and toys and McDonald's Happy Meals and it just everything. Like, it, there was just Mario everywhere. And so Sonic was created because of that. Mario Paint was created in response to parents saying, hey, you know, I hate the fact that my kids are playing video games all the time and, you know, having their brains wither away to video games. Um, you know, I want them to have a more educational experience with video games. And Nintendo realized, yeah, hey, we actually could do that. So, you know, one of the things that they decided to go with was Mario Paint. And in response to Mario Paint and how huge Mario Paint got, Sega released a thing called, um... Oh, God. It was like, uh... V Sega Visions or like Vista or something like that and it was literally Mario Paint but with Sonic and it sold awful it sold absolutely miserably yeah, it was some kind of Sega like art studio or something I can't remember exactly what the name of it was uh, blast processing was a nonsense term that was it was just like a buzzword that they tried to use to make it seem like the Genesis was more powerful than both the NES, which, I mean, it was more powerful than the NES. There's no real argument about that. But uh, that, you know, it had the edge on the SNES because of blast processing. It blast, blast processing was nonsense. It, it, there is no, it, there was no such thing. Also, wobble doobble dobble deeble that lag. Uh, okay, I'm lagging yes, a little bit. Sonic Adventure 2 battle music going on there. It's cool, cool, cool. I am... I'm actually really not that far away from home. <laughs> it, you know, this is... Mm, I... Mm. Alright, I'm gonna... Oh, I can't I can't even do that here with this uh, thing, can I? I was gonna make, like, a, a vote or something. But I, I guess I'll just do it through the chat. Um, chat, I am not really feeling this seed. Should I just make a new one? <laughs> I mean, God, I feel bad because, like, the tavern is so cool. Like, it's so nice. But, like, I've been, like, running around on nothing. It's just been ice mountains with nothing. And it's just like, hey, I'm farming coal and, you know, maybe some iron every so often, and that's cool. But, like, man, I, I, need, I need some, um... Oh, God. I need some tropics. You know what? I might actually... Hmm. I could make a nature's compass. And, ooh, hey. Don't do that. No, not in the water. Um, and find, like, a, a rainforest or something. Because I need, I need a biome like that. Because I need to find... Uh, I need to start finding, like, fruits and stuff. That's, like... That is my biggest thing with mods... One of the mods that I have is, like, one of the most critical ones for me. It's Pam's Harvest Craft. Where you can basically, like, you can make a kitchen, and you make cooking tools, and you can make, like, all sorts of different kinds of foods. And it is a huge game changer for me. I absolutely love it. I, I love being able to, like, you know, farm my own ingredients and, you know, like, just make them and, you know, make make the, uh, the base for them and... And all the little the step-by-step -step processes and whatnot. Hey, Shimby, there's a name I haven't seen in a while. 
Good to see you're safe and sound. Are you playing a mod pack? Uh, I'm playing a custom mod pack. It's basically just a bunch of mods that I cobbled together and said, hey, I like these mods. Do 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 do. God, why is this song such a banger? They they went they went all out with this song. This 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 is a this is like the I, I'm I'm gonna maybe this might may, maybe a hot take. I, I wanna say this is like the ultimate feel good Sonic song. Maybe there are some others that are a little bit more feels good. Yeah, this is the Generations version. Uh, a little bit more good feely than this, but man, this, this is like such a like a uplifting song. You like, you know, you had an awful day. Listen to this song. It's it's now it's getting better. Have I played Sonic Heroes? Yes, actually. Um, I played it all the way through, and that was another one that. Um, oh, that's really cool. I've been kicking it on Minecraft. Oh, okay, cool. Sorry, I didn't see that, Chimby. Uh, chat's kind of going by a little faster than I was anticipating. Um, yes, it needed to make up for the rest of the game. Yes, Fifi. <laughs> True. Um, it, it's funny because that was another game, like Sonic Adventure DX, where I was playing it with Deck. And we played it on Skype. What the hell? Did I just get hit by something? What was that? Please tell me that was like a, just a puffer fish or something, or, or a lag, and I'm freaking out about nothing. Oh my god, I swear to god, this game makes me jump. <laughs> it really does. Uh, and the controls for Sonic Heroes were just super awful. <laughs> I, I don't know what it was. Like, I, maybe it was just, you know, the way that games evolved and the way that control schemes evolved, um, and the fact that, you know, since... You know, the days of, like, you know, when I first got Sonic Adventure DX and Sonic Heroes, you know, I started playing PC games a lot more, and I got used to, you know, WASD controls and mouse like I'm using right now. But, man, it was just like, God, it felt like the controls were just so bad. I would just die to nonsense. I would die to, oh, I, you know, I tried to jump onto this grind rail and missed. Okay, now I'm falling and I'm dead. Now I have to restart a huge chunk of this, like, 13-minute long stage. And... That was not fun. Um, although, if you guys haven't heard, oh my god. Uh, if you guys haven't heard, they are actually making a remake of Sonic Heroes. Oh my god, get off my booty, stupid snow. I hate it. Can you feel the sunshine? Um... Yeah, the, the song's name was literally Feel the Sunshine. Um, yeah, that was from Sonic R, though. That was on the, uh, the Sega Saturn, which I ended up playing on the Sonic Gems collection. Which, that was fun. You know, that was my first experience actually playing Sonic CD, which was like, you know, that was like the huge thing that everybody was just like, you know, how come you guys didn't include... Oh my goodness, what is this lag? How come you guys didn't include Sonic CD in the Sonic Mega collection? And, you know, where is it? And can we expect it? And so on and so forth. And then they released, like, another Sonic Mega Collection with just three games on it. It was Sonic CD, Sonic R, and Sonic the Fighters. Which I played all of them. And, you know, they were they were pretty good. Sonic the Fighters I probably liked the least. But, um... Yeah, Sonic CD was just a little bit... I, I don't know. I, I, I feel like I overwhelmed myself with certain mechanics in video games, and I just couldn't get used to the past and present thing. I was like, wait, what am I doing? Do I go to the past, or do I go to the present, or do I go to the future? Like, does it matter? Like, how do I do this? Sonic R's soundtrack is so good, yes. This is actually a song from Sonic Heroes, too. This is a special stage. And they thought it was so lame! Wow, they have bad taste in music. Bad taste! Um... However, uh, speaking of Sega announcements, I'm disappointed that the Crazy Taxi, new Crazy Taxi, a live service game? For what? 
Like what, like what console is my buddy here? Hey, how you doing, buddy? Look at me. Thank you. Yes, I live here. This is my house. Mine. Um, which is weird. They should not have been at music school. Wait, this was at music school? Bro, can you wake up, please? Oh, that's right. The, the time isn't moving forward. Uh, if I, I'm sure if I do time set like 200 or something, he'll get up. Yeah, there he goes. How you doing, buddy? Hey. Oh, he's unemployed, but he lives in this room. I think. I think the way to get around that is you have to make something like um, like a fletching table or like a cartography table or something. Place it in here, and then he'll become that. I, mean, I imagine on everything since it's modern Sega. Yeah, like, that's what I'm wondering. Like, is it... I mean, because sometimes they don't play... They don't put it on everything. Terrible. Absolutely terrible, uh, Shimbi. I, I can't even believe what I'm hearing right now. Oh, there was a smoker here. Oh, and a crafting table. Whoops. Lol. Haha, <laughs> whoops. Hey, a crafting table right here. Oh, I already farmed that out, right? Um, oh right, I was gonna make a, uh, oh, I need redstone! Crap. Mm. -na -na -na. We're Sonic uh, Adventure 2 music. My teacher thought it was him. Okay, what's going on there? That's, nothing about that is acceptable. <laughs> also, as I usually do, I, I totally forgot. I was in the middle of a story and then got distracted by something else. Um... Minecraft is more than enough of a horror game for me because there was one time where I was playing a single player world. I and I will never forget this. I was in the Nether. I found a Nether fortress and I started, you know, creeping around the Nether fortress. There was no enemies around. I was like, "Oh man, this is perfect. You know, I'll just I'll find the chests, I'll farm them and, you know, get the hell out." Huh, hell. Get it? Nether. No, no, no. Um and I went outside onto one of the balconies, you know, where they have the, the nether brick fence. And I went out there just to kind of see, you know, like what, what was outside. And as I walked outside, the split second I'm in range, a wither skeleton drops down, like, right in my face. And, you know, you hear the, the fall damage and the clatter, and he hits me. And I jumped like I, it, it, like it was a jump scare. Like I jumped out of my skin. I, I was so freaked out. I think I literally had to like pause the game and like take a breath for a few minutes because, oh lord, that was uh, that was that was a jumper. I didn't like that at all. So Minecraft is more than enough of a horror game for me. Hello, surround zero one zero. I remember that name. Please don't tell me you're going to ask me about uh, video inputs and things like that. Let's let's keep it to you know the the stream and what's going on here. Uh, Smoker, where's Tashigi? Ha wa wa wee wa wee wa woo. I remember being scared as a kid that Slenderman was going to show up in Minecraft. I don't know what was going on. Well, I mean, there's the Enderman. It's basically like Slenderman, <laughs> right? Hmm. God, I. Mm. There was. I. I remember. I had another seed where there was literally just like some redstone, just, just sitting out. There was like a big block of it, and there was like some redstone, um, just out in the random wilderness. And man, I could really go for that right now instead of having to dig down and try to find redstone. I literally just need one. I need one redstone. Then I can make a compass, and then I can make a nature's compass. Unless I find a compass, that's. That's, yeah, that, that could happen. Find like a sunken ship or something. I love Maple Stories music. Oh, please don't sink in the snow. Please don't sink in the snow. <laughs> Blazing Archwood? No. Oh. Lag? Yeah, that looks like a Blazing Archwood. I'm glad you're back. It's weird, but in a roundabout way, I met one of my best friends who I work with professionally through your channel. Wow, awesome. That is very cool. Oh, hey, here's something. Pomegranates! 
every time I see pomegranates, I, I mentioned at the beginning of the stream that, you know, Space Ghost. Um, <laughs> there is an episode where he is interviewing, um, uh, not just what's his name, um, uh, oh god, what's, what's his name, um, Mike Judge, the creator of Beavis and Butthead and, uh, you know, King of the Hill. He also interviews, um, Harlan Williams. I, now, I'm not familiar with him, I think he's like a stand-up comedian or something, but, he ends up going through, like, some really weird, like, I, I don't know, it, it's like the weirdest, like, most surreal jokes I think I've ever heard from a guest on that show. And he says at one point, you probably have, like, daydreams about pomegranates and pomegranates and, like, it echoes in Space Ghost's head. Pomegranates, sea fleece, sea fleece. Timber, chocolate chip, cookie dough. You like wood, don't you? <laughs> well, sure I do. Who doesn't like wood? Cedar, mahogany, rustic pine. Yes, wood is good food. Bing. <laughs> I swear to God, there's uh, endless episodes that I could I, I, I could really just recount word for word. <laughs> I've seen them so many times. <laughs> Hero Brian. I literally thought Hero Brian was there earlier. I thought I was getting Hero Brian earlier in the stream. Hey, exceedingly average. I remember playing Minecraft for the first time in a while with my son, and I encountered an Elder Guardian. Oh my god, the game lagged so hard it froze for a sec. Um, that is one of my big no-nos. No, 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 no. I do not like the Elder Guardians, specifically for the fact that they have that damn jump scare that pops up on the screen. I, like, it, it has gotten to the point where if I am anywhere near a deep ocean of any temperature, I will look ahead with my little mini map, or my map, my world map here. It's called Zero's World Map, if I can open it. That's... That's not opening it. That's that's full screen. Oh, see now now I've just messed the whole window up. Zeros when mini map. There it is. Okay. Um, I will literally look ahead and check to see if there are any ocean monuments. And if there are, oh hey, it's a um, inventory pet spawner. And if there are, I will literally mark it with a waypoint, telling me to get the hell away from that. Do not come anywhere near this area because there is an ocean monument. That's how much that freaks me out. Yeah, hey, Justin. Um, yeah, I remember. The infamous lover of Croatia. It, so, two things really quick, Justin. First of all, I see you log in on Steam a lot. I do see you. Every time I see you, I'm just like, oh, hey, it's Justin. And second of all, I was actually just talking a week ago with my friends about Solar Eclipse. And it was funny because as we were talking about it, I was going, you know, gee, I wonder if Solar Eclipse is still around. And then somebody uploaded, you know, for like from your group, somebody uploaded a video, like a YouTube poop, of like the, the king is upset that Solar Eclipse deleted his channel. And I sat there like, wait, do I remember this? Do I remember him deleting his channel? And then... I was talking to Dak, and Dak was just like, yeah, you, you mentioned it to us. I was like, oh, I don't remember that. <laughs> I don't remember that. And this was like 13 years ago or something, so that was kind of crazy. Oh, the episode with Thurston Moore. The, that episode is, it, I, I like that episode. I do. But it's definitely one of my least favorites for the fact that it makes me feel sad because it's literally a tribute episode to Sonny Chirac, which is the guy that made the most of the music. He made the intro theme. He made uh, you know a bunch of the like uh, segue music and stuff like that, uh, and the ending tune and, and all that stuff. Um, and it makes me feel sad, you know. You know, it's a, I I don't I don't like that he, you know he died so so suddenly so soon. Um, and also the, 
the episode is basically just them listening to that music and like really nothing happening. Where Thurston Moore was actually um, uh, cr uh, they, they, they said his name was Fred Cracklin but it was actually Thurston Moore from Sonic Youth. Yes, Kiki Cat, I am back. Hey. Oh, okay. Understandable, Justin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's if it's private, yeah, I, I wouldn't I wouldn't want you to, you know, say it in public like that. Um, but yeah, no, that that's good to know. That is good to know. I I appreciate the uh, the update. That is cool. He he was definitely one of my favorite people to talk to. He he was a lot of fun. And you know the the Mario Kart Wii stuff that we did together. That was fun too. The reason why he came up was because I said that I believe the reason why I got my channel got so popular was because I collaborated with so many other different channels and because there was a bunch of other different channels that like linked to mine. So I think for the YouTube's algorithm, you know, it's like it's seeing like, hey, this channel is mentioning this, this channel, and this channel has this many subscribers. So we're going to give, you know, a little bit more of a bump to this channel that it's referencing. And then that kind of makes the, the popularity of my channel because somebody else with, you know, X, X amount of subscribers is, um, you know, uh, linking to my channel. So it kind of bumps me up. Um, and I really, that really started to taper off after the Super Mario Galaxy 2 playthrough. And that's when the popularity of my channel started to go down, down, and down because my friends at the time stopped doing YouTube videos. So when they stopped, uh, I didn't really have anybody else linking to me. So once that died out, then my popularity started to die out too. So I, I think that's what happened. And I specifically, we, we talked about the video that I made um, where I shouted out a bunch of different channels once Mario Kart Wii was, my Mario Kart Wii, um, a uh, 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 series was done and I shouted out a bunch of channels. I was like, hey, you know, watch these guys. They also do Mario Kart Wii, but they also do awesome stuff too. And one of them was uh, Solar Eclipse. Um, bidi 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 bidi. Is this mod pack? Second time I got that question. Um, it's, I mean, it's like technically it's a mod pack, but again, it's just a bunch of mods that I cobbled together and said, hey, I like these mods. Whoa, what is this? Whoa! Yellowstone? Oh, this is from Terralith. Oh, cool! Oh, this is like, um... This is like those pools. Uh, those sulfur pools at Yellowstone. Right? They're, they're sulfur pools, right? They're like the big yellow... They're like big yellow pools, and they have like that really, like... I think it's like sulfuric water in the middle. That's probably why there's magma, magma blocks here to just like burn you or whatever. And blackstone, that's cool. Oh, this is cool. That's, I like this. This is nice. Oh, what's that? Oh, ooh, what's that? Guys, we're finding stuff. What is this? Whoa, what? This is huge. What is this? I'm trying to like, I, I want to go down there, but like at the same time, I'm like thinking about like, how do I get back up? <laughs> I, I guess I'll have to dig my way up. Wow, this is cool. the best way <laughs> also yes get it cobbling <laughs> oh what a witch villa this is a villa oh this is supposed to oh my god okay i'm gonna be completely honest here with you folks i'm glad that i'm in <laughs> peaceful right now i assume that there's supposed to be like t a ton of bad guys that spawn here oh my god this is freaky Oh, hey, a boat. I could I could use that, I guess. Oh, and stuff, I guess. It's beaten up, but whatever. Better than nothing. I don't have a sword. I don't have a sword! There's nothing in here. Okay, goodbye. 
make some ladders. I've, you know, I've never been a fan of ladders. I, I do not like ladders. I would much rather have a bucket of water and use that as a ladder. I love this song. What is this song? This is from Final Fantasy XIV. Oh, the Labyrinth. This is um, the very first 24-man raid. This is, oh, this is such a nice song. It's got, I remember it's got two different versions. It's got this, where you and you and your buds are, you know, just kind of traversing around Lapis. And then it's got a, a more um, action-y version when you're battling stuff. <gasps> and it's got fire in it? Ooh! Oh, wait, if I break it, it's, it's not going to... It's not going to have fuel in it anymore, is it? Hey, stop lagging. Um, yeah, I don't think... Yeah, I don't... Mm. I'm going to get rid of this tomatillo. Tomatillo. Oh, that's not... There we go. <laughs> Whoops. Well, maybe it'll still have fuel in it. I don't know. There, I know there's a mod that, like, it does... It... Uh, saves, like, how much fuel is in there from whatever to whatever. What is chiseled bookshelf? What is that? And it's a vanilla thing? Yeah, this this would suck. Especially because I, I don't have, like, any I don't have anything, any weapons. So what happens if I break this? Do I just get does this give me three books? This gives me two books? This gives me one book? Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, there's three books. One book? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, wait, no, that was three. Okay, I'm confused. <laughs> I don't I don't know what the difference is. I don't, I don't know what a chiseled bookshelf is. I don't know what mod you have. Vanilla of brewing stands are impossible to fuel. You need to play this one. Well, I mean, yeah, I, I know you need Blizz Powder, but there are, um, like I said, there's uh, a mod that I know does keep the amount of... I, I, I remember it was Lapis, when you put in an enchanting table, and it would just keep the Lapis in there forever. Like, you know, until you use it again, or take it out, or whatever. Help. Oh, Whoa! What in the world did I just stumble into? What is this? I guess I'll make do oh. Oh my god, I got it, I made the best. Ooh, and a clock. Ooh, and wait! Ow. Oh. Dang it. Oh, I'm sneeze. Oh skeleton horse! Skeleton horse! Oh, is this what this is supposed to be? They're like experimenting on the donkeys and the and this one it died, I guess, and broke out. Oh my god, look at all this stuff. <laughs> it must hit the gym a lot. Hee <laughs> hee. Only in Croatia. <laughs> um I'm gonna make a marker here. I'm just gonna call it no, not stiff. I'm gonna call it stiff. Make it nice and bright green so it stands out. I have JEI installed. Yes, I do. And if I could like stop like freezing and lagging and stuff, it's probably because I'm streaming. S stream program that's uh, eating up my CPU. Um, beep 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 beep. Um 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 um. What was I saying? Uh, oh JEI. Yeah. When I when I hit E here, this is all. Oh, this is JEI. Oh, totem of a nine. Don't think I'll ever get that in this run, but maybe. <laughs> what was that song? Elevate and meditate. Elevate and meditate. <laughs> oh, I like those little. Uh, I like those little emotes. I don't think I ever found like that. Oh my goodness, this is in lag. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna try to close. 
See if I can close Firefox here. Maybe that might help. Um, I don't think I ever actually found that song. <laughs> like, I don't remember, like, what... Oh, oh, it was in a Trackmania stage. Right, yeah, we were playing Trackmania. But I don't remember, like, the name of the song. Or, like, who sung it or anything. Oh, this is so cool! Fire Emblem Oh my god, lag! I really like this song, and it was the only reason I played Bridge of Elden. Oh, what? what not, not Bridge of Elden. Um. Wait, wasn't it? No, Bridge of Elden was Legend of Zelda. Oh, what is this now? Oh, cool! Meaty, meaty, meaty stuff. Oh, iron! Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We got pumpkins. Okay, that's cool. Okay, got pumpkins. We got mushroom here. Some mushrooms. If I need those. Whenever you mention lag, I think of your new Super Mario Bros. Wii playthrough. Oh, okay, see you later, uh, Sparkly Mop. Appreciate it. Thank you for coming. Thank you, thank you. Um, I don't, I do not remember this lag that you speak of. Oh, no block. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. I guess it doesn't work because of the spider web. <laughs> I remember it matters what block you put underneath them. Makes it makes a different like instrument sound. Wow, what is going on here? Bottles of enchanting! And another weight disc! And jukeboxes! And more note blocks! <laughs> Oh, whoops. Yeah. Uh, I guess I'll just have to do this the old fashioned way. I'm sorry, Fence. I didn't mean it. I'm sorry, bud. I'm, I'm sure he'll uh, he'll get over it. Glad you're doing back. Uh, have a great night. All right. See you later. Bye bye, Evan. Thank you for coming. I, I keep forgetting. I genuinely, I keep forgetting like what time it is. <laughs> my my friggin' my uh, my clock is all messed up here sparkly mop with the 15 thank you so much sparkly uh, you know like i mean seriously generosity like i really really appreciate that not only for the fact that you know like the, the super chat that you just did but um also um you know the, the, the you did the patron thing too so that was really awesome of you i i really 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 appreciate that dude thank you so much <sighs> also go watch some more one piece will you <laughs> Oh no, I don't have space! Fire emblem, help me out. What do I do? I guess I'll just get rid of this glass bottle. I, mm, I guess I could get rid of the sticks. Those are pretty easy to make. Hmm. Hmm. Bunch of emulator issues. I mean, I do remember playing it on an emulator. I remember I had to, I had to bind the uh, Wii Remote Shake function to one of the shoulder buttons that I was playing on, like the older like PC controller that I had, which I think was the same exact controller that I used for Sonic. Um, was it Sonic Generations? And <laughs> the one that glitched out on me when I was on the Sonic Heroes stage. Oh dear, that was, that was, <laughs> the, the, the tumbling, the tumbling, the tumbling, the tumbling, the tumbling. <laughs> like, how do I make it stop tumbling? Maybe, maybe that's why it glitched out, because that was actually the shoulder button that you would use to make Sonic tumble that way. Maybe it was because I used it so much during the new Super Mario Bros. Wii playthrough that it, it bugged out. Listen, Kiki Cat, that is not an option. Don't you dare say that. I need these cooking uh, ingredients. This is this is my whole thing, okay? I need these cooking ingredients. I have to make foods. The foods are very important. Pam's Harvest Craft is the most critical mod that I have here. Well, there are some other critical mods, but but Pam's Harvest Craft is a biggie. It, it's it's a biggie biggie. The tumbling never stops with age. <laughs> okay. I don't 
I don't get that, but it sounds funny. <laughs> Not an option. Don't say it again. Otherwise, you and me, we're going to have words. Um, yeah, so remember how I said, how do I get back out of here? <laughs> this is uh, This would be that time. Oh, dear. And my pickaxe is almost dead. Yeah, we're, um, we're doing fine. Everything's fine. Everything's good. Everything is fantastic. We're going to make it out of here. <laughs> you know what? I actually, I just, I just thought of something. I, I want to give another YouTuber shout out. And this is going to be a YouTuber that literally everybody knows. Uh... So his, I, I've been watching his videos. I'm, I'm not trying. I'm not going to say it just yet. I've been watching his videos quite a lot lately. Um, I used to watch him only for FNAF content because he was the only YouTuber that I ever would watch FNAF content content from. So whenever there was like a new game, straight to his channel. Nobody else's. But in recent years, I found out that he also did a Minecraft Let's Play by himself. He did one with his friends, but he also did one with himself. And I have watched that Minecraft Let's Play by himself over and over and over and over again. And it's just so much fun to watch. And I've been watching his stuff ever since. He does play a lot of horror games, but I, you know, I can deal with it because he's, he's, a, he's a decent guy. He's, uh, you know, he, he makes it funny. No, you are actually right, Justin. It is Markiplier. I, I have been watching a lot of Markiplier lately. And, again, like, his his Minecraft stuff was just a lot of fun to watch. The, the only, the sad thing, dates, 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 dates. Oh, my God, I found dates. I need those really badly. Um, and the apricots. I think these are grapefruits. Yeah, I saw apricots earlier. Um... I, I, it was... Uh, oh no, what was I saying? Minecraft, Markiplier. Um, fun, watch, yes, enjoyable. Oh, the, the sad thing was, um, he, uh, he hasn't finished it. <laughs> it's like, the last video is like, oh, it, that wasn't the last video, but like, yeah, he, like, he comes back to it after like a year, and then like does some other stuff, but like his, his whole goal for the entire, like, Let's Play was, Getting to the end and beating the Ender Dragon. He still hasn't done that. Hey, Webkins, how's it going? So I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm still waiting patiently for that. He's been doing that new, uh, that new um, flavor of the month game, um, uh, a difficult game about climbing, which is very much like Getting Over It, but it's not an actual Getting Over It sequel. <laughs> Which, God, that, that game bothers me, not because of the fact that it's difficult, but because I have a thing with, like, my fingernails. So it's like watching this, like, this game character or whatever, like, dig his, like, fingertips into the rocks or whatever. Ah, oh, it's just, it, it kills me. It's like nails on a chalkboard. Oh, I saw this earlier, and... Wow. <laughs> this must be a sign. <laughs> 1900 blocks this way is a, is a village. Beautiful. Alrighty. See, <laughs> alright, see you later, Justin. Oh my god. I, uh, I hope that the snow golem has been doing a good job of, you know, keeping tabs on my house. My house! My house! Hello! Mine! Excuse me! Hey! I'm over here. My house. Don't forget it. Keep it safe. Dude. Uh, let's move this here. And then this here. And then we'll start putting all the food, 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 food. This is technically food. But it's a questionable ration. I'll put it in here, whatever. Food, 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 food. 
Food, 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 food. Food, 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 food. Food. I don't think I have enough spaces for all this. <laughs> no, I do not. Oh no, I need, I literally need, oh, never mind. I need four more, five more, six more. Shut up. Um, let me see, I can do, oh, I can, wait a minute, can I do this? With the archwood planks, I can make a chest to rue. Really? I cannot make a chest with archwood planks. That's a scam. Um, well, can I at least make, oh, actually, no, I need it, I need it, I need it, I need it. I need it to do. Oh, uh, no, it, it did not carry over the fuel. It is gone. <clears throat> um, beady, 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 boop, bop, bip. Uh, let's, let's, yes, here, yeah, here, yeah, here. Yeah. And then this, and I'm actually gonna hold on to this. Oh, let me make more torches. Torchers, get your inconvenient torchers here. here and then I need another um do I have tinkers construct I don't think so so I should be able to yeah there we go uh at tink no I do not have tinkers construct I remember when I was doing a 116 run I did have tinkers construct but the thing is I don't really use tinkers construct Though, the, the real thing was, I had Tinker's Construct in anticipation of having friends that were gonna, like, join the server that actually do use Tinker's Construct. I, I don't. I, I don't really, like, it's, like, so complicated for me. Twitch culture has changed. Front page literally has a music artist I listen to talking about their music and supposedly playing Mario Kart? That's cool. <laughs> Uh, speaking of the Twitch culture changing, I did see some uh, very... Oh, this isn't food. Some very uh, questionable material, which I think that they... This is my house. Stop pushing me! It's my house. Stop it. Stop. I'm going to push back. I'm pushing you back. I'm pushing back at you. Don't you... Stop it. Stop it. Good questionable material that I think they cracked down on recently. Look, there's your there's your dad. That's your dad. He's not alive anymore. And you might not be either. My house. <laughs> he looked at me for a sec. The questionable material was his dabe. Hey, boys B, how's it going? Uh, oh, whoops, I need friggin' freaky frack. Oh, I, no, um, dang it, I had other, there was stuff, and I need to go farm it, and, and get it, and bring it back, and stuff like that. Might as well make a, um, uh, bd 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 pickaxe while I'm at it. Stick to these, I should be able to make sticks out of these, okay. If I couldn't make sticks out of those, then I was gonna say, okay, Ars Novu, what are you doing? I'm, sp I'm pronouncing that right, right? Is it no, no vu? It's new in French. No vu, right? Novo, no vu? It is indeed a jack o' lantern set. It's, it's literally called that. It's literally called a jack o' lantern. See? Jack o' lantern. Um, what mods do you have any, like, tech mods? Um. I remember. Oh, uh, Ender, Ender IO, I have. Um, although I think that's an alpha right now. Um, God, I used to use Ender IO so much in twelve two. That that one, it wasn't as complex as Tinker's Construct for me, but it definitely did have like some machines and stuff that I was just like, yeah, you know, I don't think I'm ever gonna use these ever. And I did need to like Wikipedia how to like, um, uh connect uh like certain machines together like you had to make the, the, the like the power generator and then you like you could connect it to like the sag mill and the what were the other ones um the, 
there's like the thing that would regenerate your weapons, like energy level or whatever. That was fun. Oh, cabbage. Cucumber! Parsnip. Parsnip. And uh, amaranth. Okay. And a blackberry. And a peanut. That's blackberry, right? Oh, elderberry. Okay. Elderberry. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Sugar cane. Sugar cane. Gimme, 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 gimme. How is that sugar cane even alive? There's no water here. L literally, no water. Game's cheating. Whoa, oh crap. Uh-oh. Oh god. Uh yeah. <laughs> quite a lot surround. <laughs> quite quite a lot indeed. In indeed. Oh, oh cashews. Cashews here. Okay, good, good. Get the cashews. And olives. Oh, olives. Yeah, olives are good. I need olives. Olive, the other reindeer. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who remembers that? I do. Dates. All right, those are grapefruits. This is papaya. More grapefruits. Lychees. Yep. Lychees. Oh, vanilla! No, ho, 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 it's a good vanilla! Star fruits. And, oh, more dates. Hog herbs. <clears throat> Mechanism. Because the ore processing features allow you to double up to pentuple ores and it also electric tools. Um, yeah, I, I think Ender IO has something similar to that. Um, I remember there's like, oh, peppercorn. I remember there's um, <clears throat> uh, specific ingots, yeah, there's like the a vibrant alloy, pulsating alloy, dark steel, yeah, and stuff like that. You have to make all this stuff. What the heck? <laughs> it's an upside down bucket. That's funny. Oh, I should have made a bucket! Ugh. Dang it. Or dates. Rambutan? Yeah, rambutan. And coconuts. Mm. And more peppercorn. Oh, bananas! Yes, now we're in business. Now we are in business. Oh, what's this? Now, now what did I find? Good God! I'm should I be scared? A swamp village. I guess this is. There's supposed to be witchy poos here too. Oh. Oh, there's there's one of the Ender IO things. Hey Lebo, thank you for stopping on by. I appreciate the kind words. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate you stopping on by. Um, I should probably just wait until that breaks, honestly. Okay. <laughs> oh, my favorite color. Oh, an orchid. I feel like this is yet another thing where, like, a bunch of, like, bad guys would spawn. Luckily, I have it in place. Pleaseful. Oh, hey, a lectern. What is the lectern turn the villagers into? Is it a book person? Maybe I, maybe I can turn that guy, the one that's in the little tavern. It's unemployed. Maybe I can make him a uh, a book person. Oh, Chicky Chicks. Hello, Chicky. Would you like to be free? Yes, you would. <laughs> be free! Good chunk of mods have some sort of... Could you shift your layout playing with William to the left or right? It's blocking your hotbar. Ow! Oh, how come nobody told me this? Oh, okay, I see. Oh, okay, I didn't I didn't realize that. Okay. Um Okay, yeah, I'll just move it over here, I guess. Boop. And then yes, good, yes, mm-hmm, yeah, mm-hmm. Okay, good. Perfect. More bananas! 
A good chunk of mods have some sort of grinder pulverizer shredder, which is usually the Oh, yeah. Oh my god, more dates. Good god. It's like the game just knew. I need dates. Okay, give them all the dates. Ooh, passion fruits. Or are they? Yeah, I don't think those are plums. Oh, they're figs! Wow, I was. <laughs> I was way off with both! <laughs> passion fruits. Oh, yeah, no, they're plums. Nope, neither. Idiot. Stupid. Oh! That really did not take as much damage as I thought it was going to. Now, where is all that stuff? Yes, I need that stinking stuff. Where'd that stuff go? Here it is. Oh my god. Ah! You're freaking me out. You're really freaking No, don't walk towards me. Don't walk towards me. Stop it. You're really freaking me out, bud. Oh, I don't want the... Mm, I don't want the stupid Curse of Vanishing books. Blech. Blech. Nobody wants that nonsense. Oh, I didn't go down here. Hi? <laughs> okay. That was anticlimactic. Singing mode, I don't even need to spend points. True! That is very true. Have you ever played Mother 3? Ah, uh, oh my god. I... <laughs> I have been meaning to get around to it for, like, 15 years now. <laughs> and I still never have. Which is kind of sad, because, you know, I, I played the heck out of Earthbound. And, you know, I, I, I completed it multiple times, and... Oh. And, uh... Ooh. And I feel like it would be, you know, a good fit for me to actually play it. But, no, I still have it. A milk bucket and uh, brown mushrooms. And I have no space again. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of this. Actually, you know what? Here, let's do this. Boom, boom. Ah, oh, there we go. So smart. Okay. Um... No, I don't think we're gonna do that with a bowl. I don't think we're gonna do that with a pumpkin pear. Oh. Mm -mm. Okay, cool. If you tame the skelly horse, you can get if you get a saddle. I really don't want the skeleton horse. It just freaks me out. <laughs> the red eyes, man. The red eyes are just like they're killing me. <laughs> the red eyes. <laughs> I feel like it's gonna actually murder me if I try to ride it. You have died. Died to skeleton horse. Emeralds! Poggers! Hmm. Oh, wait, what are these? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, right, those don't go here, they go here. Alright. Gotta make villager noises whenever I can. Huh? 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 I'm just I'm getting so many books. I literally do not have to farm leather or paper ever. Which, oh, I forgot to mention this the whole time. Um, I am doing this vegan. This is a vegan run. I'm not going to eat any meat. I'm not going to kill any animals. I'm going to make food that is non-animal based. So it has to be all like... The, the biggest thing that I need is soybeans, because I need to make tofu. And then with the soybeans and the tofu, you can basically just make everything you could with meat. And this one also has power, which is not going to transfer. Yay. <laughs> Paleo keto friendly, yes. Indeed. Yes, indeed. I have so many books, this is actually kind of disgusting. Um, I, I literally am out of space. Um... This is a huge treasure trove of stuff that I was not anticipating, or expecting, or wanting, because I do not have the space. But I need leather. Ooh. I need leather badly. Um, oh yeah. We're funkin' on a Wednesday night. <laughs> Once again, I have to remember, like, what day and what time it is. <laughs> I'm just like, 
I'm totally out of. Ooh, what's going on here? Physics. All right. Oh, this is supposed to be like the toilet, huh? What is going on? I'm. Am I not placing these torches? What? What the heck was that? Oh, I was opening the door. I always run out of space and everything. Okay, see you later, Kiki. Thank you for uh, popping on in. Oh, that's right. Yes, it's World Party Day today. I forgot. Thank you for reminding me, Webkins. So it's funky time, but not Funky Kong. Just funky time. Don't 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 mix the two. It's just funky time, okay? Like like Kamek time. It's just oh, snow and rain and snow together. Why is it raining in this one spot? But then this is an ice marsh. Why is it raining in something called an ice marsh? Wouldn't it be snowing in an ice marsh? Okay, whatever. I'm not gonna question that any further. Just, you know, just gonna let it be. I I like how I came here specifically to farm the stuff that I didn't get. Oh my god. <sighs> that I didn't get last time. And ended up getting even more stuff. And now I can't... Oh, I can't even farm the stuff that I wanted to get. <laughs> it literally rained snow while I was at work today. I was like, why? <laughs> do you have any plans to do Mario Wonder? Uh, yeah, actually, I do. Um, so, the original plan was... Oh, what's in here? Oh, stuff. <laughs> I need bone meal, bone meal. Um, the original plan was that we weren't going to get evicted and that I was actually going to have money to buy to buy stuff and that I would buy Mario Wonder first day and play first day and make a playthrough of it first day. Um, that didn't happen. Um, so... I guess it'll just happen when it happens. Um, I, I do still intend to play it. You know, I've heard nothing but good things about it. Um, and it seems like a fantastic game. And yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do it. Hey, Sly Kid, thank you so much. I am glad to be back. And I'm glad to have you here. What do you think of that? Huh. Got you with that one. <laughs> Didn't see. Never saw it coming. He never saw it coming. His name is Sly Kid, and he never saw that coming. Oh my god. Oof. Just call me Sly Man. <laughs> 291486. It, yeah, like I said, it, it does look like a fantastic game, and I, I am. I'm eager to play it. Honestly, um. And this is going to sound really weird, maybe. Um, but I, you know, once I, and I'm, I'm looking over at it right now, like, because it's physically right there. Uh, once I set up my my uh, old consoles and stuff, um, I wanted to jump on them ASAP. And so I've been actually playing quite a bit of NES at the moment. Um, I've, ac I've actually been playing um, Super Mario Bros. 3 all the way through. And right now I'm in World 6. Getting close to the Enderworld 6. The Iced Land. Yeah, you better shock Pikachu if you know it's good for you. Ooh, limes. Are these apricots? Yeesh. We could get your crush. I love, I love my DJ Max music. You know what's funny? I actually have not listened to this playlist in a very long time. So when I was just like kind of test listening to it, making sure all the music like still works, you know, like all the vile paths and stuff are still valid, I was, I was jamming. <laughs> I was jamming out. And talk about wonder while I be understanding the portal plot lines. Oh my, have the tables have turned. You talking about what? 
wonder while I be understanding the portal pines. Oh my, oh how the tables have turned. What, what is, what does portal have to do with that? Oh my god, thank you so much, Primo! Thank you, have a great night, great to see you in Positive Series. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! So much, I really appreciate it, Primo, and I'm really, really glad to see you again. Um, god, please, pop by the Discord more often, we love having you. But, uh, also, yes, good night, Primo, sleep tight, don't let the bed book the bite. Should I try to tame a chocobo? What do you guys think? Should I should I try to tame a, cho a chocobo? Because I keep running by the, all these like gashel, gashel greens, and and then I remember there was that little little gaggle of uh, chocobos. I don't really know what a group of chocobos is called, so I'm just gonna call them a gaggle. I could. I decided to look more into Portal today and trying to understand the whole plot line. Um. So Chell is a test subject, but it turns out that she is not just a test subject. It turns out that GLaDOS is actually the reincarnation of a person who worked for the original person who created Aperture Science Labs and got herself turned into GLaDOS when she died. And it turns out that Chell is it heavily implied to be her daughter. That's, that's basically it. And Shell is extremely super smart when it comes to puzzles and is incredibly brave and fearless. I'm gonna need this clock, but I need a item frame. Oh, I got two copies of weight. Doe. Oh my god, I have so many books! I have two stacks! Two and a quarter stacks, actually. I'm wondering if I should just keep... You know what? I I, I will. I will keep that milk bucket, because I have not seen cows yet. And I need a milk bucket to make something with Ars Novu. Oh my god, can we please just delete this stone pickaxe? Good god, it's been at like 1 HP for 20,000 years now. All right. Um. Beep 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 beep. beep. I guess we'll just put this. In. Oh wait, this is food. 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 This is not food. Oh, a sword. Okay. And then. Oh, I got more chests. Okay, that's good. 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 Do those open? No, because those are not slabs. Please tell me there's something over me. Over. Over that. Overneath. I literally just made up a word. Oh, underneath. Meet overneath. Didn't know about the thought daughter theory. It's just Mercy Mario. Yeah, it's 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 interesting. Hey, Dragonite! So glad that you could break away from whatever extremely important thing that you were doing, Dragonite, in order to join us. I do appreciate it, Dragonite. Thank you for showing up, Dragonite. You are a very cool guy for showing up, Dragonite. Thank you. Oh my God! My run up El Monte feels like forever ago when I first watched your Mario 64 LP. Got me through some bad times. Happy to see you back in these inspirations one day at a time, you know. You got this. Thank you so much, Myra Belmonte. You are super awesome, and I really appreciate how generous you are. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I really, really appreciate that. It means a lot. It is a, uh, it's been a struggle, and that is definitely helping make it less so. Wait. Now oh, there's a little, little, little music notes popping out. Uh, I'm gonna keep this on me because I know I'm gonna need that later down the line. I'm mm, God. I need one more spruce plank, and then I can. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I can kind of do that. Oop. And then I can do this, this, 
this, this, and, and this, this, there we go, ah, much better. Okay, we're all nice and nice and tucked in again. No, no snow coming in here, no sorry Bob. Listen, you! Yeah, that's right. Who lives here? Me. Hey, what did I tell you about pushing me? Don't you do that. Yeah, you better go to your corner. Oh, I could. Hmm. Would this work if I put a if I put a slab right here? Will it still open? Nope. No, it will not. Oh god! Now I gotta break this, and then I gotta place it again. Oh my god! Uh, oh man! Life's rough. Actually, I was sleeping well, but now that I'm here, I guess I could also not sleep. Oh really? Is that how that works? When you're when you're not sleeping, you're not sleeping. That's okay. Interesting. I feel like I learned a lot today. Great. Now I feel like playing Minecraft again. Good. Make uh, maybe I'll make uh, a server again, and you know we'll hang out because that was fun. I I don't think I don't think I'd do Pixelmon again. Which I mean, it, it was fun, but it just it kind of felt like we weren't doing anything. Like, I feel like with Pixelmon, you really have to, like, you really have to, like, build your Pokemon up and then, like, go on adventures and do stuff. It's just, like, it, it feels like otherwise you're just kind of stuck doing nothing until that happens. Or, you know, you could just Minecraft. What am I doing? Uh, oh, I need to make a nature's compass. Beep. Bop. Blibbledy bloop. Yeah, okay, over here, jumping, and then doing this, and I need some logs. Log, 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 log. One, two, three, four. And then, oh, I need saplings, saplings, saplings. I hope these count. Because the, <laughs> those are the only saplings I have. So I think it goes one, two, three, four. And then one, two, three, four. I see you walking around out there. Crazy. Oh, yeah, it works! Yay! I got an interest compass! What just happened? What's going on? Why am I warping? What the? Oh man, not again! Uh, stupid ice. Well, I brought that on myself. That is really weird. I don't. I don't know what mod is doing that. Why it's making me warp? But apparently, corp co uh, compasses make me warp. Uh, now, apparently. Any plans to get... Oh, the TTYD remake. Um, maybe. I feel like I was flip-flopping between doing Minecraft and new things and Pokemon things and never really playing both. Yeah, I know. That That was, like, the that was like the biggest thing. Like, you, it just felt like it was so hard to focus on, like, both. Like, you had to focus on one. Ooh, Super Mario Land 2. I had to struggle myself when I was playing Rystar. Boss 3, I was running in the max of 5 health stars, which could damage. It made me angry. It doesn't realize... I'm playing no damage on normal mode. How easy I try. Rystar is a very difficult game. That's all I really know about it. I d well, actually, no, I mean, that's not true. I did play it. But, I mean, from everything I've heard, like, yes, it is very, very hard. And I played it on the aforementioned uh, Sonic Mega Collection, as I was talking about earlier. Um... I like how I have this, like, this one guy that, like, hangs out and lives here. Where do you go, anyway? No, it wasn't Cedric. Was it? Oh, it was this guy. He's, like, all the way out here. Man, he is taking a walk. Sir, are you good? Oh, there's two. Now. Oh, okay. We're not going to question that. We're just going to go back. <laughs> 
Uh, yeah, but the TTYD remake, it looks so good. It really does. I... I hate everything. Again, for the umpteenth time, this is why I turn snow... This is why I turn freezing damage off. Oh my god. Uh, this is the worst. Any who's in floozin. Um, I really wish that they would have started with Paper Mario 64 first and then, you know, kind of went down the line. Because, you know, I, I... As much as, like, TTYD was fun, I just... Paper Mario 64 is just... It, it's just such a big, big part of... Like, a, a, an era of when I was growing up. Like, not... I don't want to necessarily say, like, when I was a kid. Because I wasn't. I was actually a teenager when it came out. Um, but, um... It was... You know. My cat is going to the bathroom. On stream, okay? I, I mean, it's censored. You can't see it. it you, there's nothing to see. But she's going. I don't know if you guys can hear that. She's just kind of digging around. Okay. <laughs> it's, you know, Webkins, that was actually a funny thing that really made me give, like, a second thought to... Okay, we're not going to walk over the snow this time. Um, second thought to, you know, all the face cam stuff was, you know, throughout the years when I was, like, streaming and stuff, and just, like, all the goofy stuff and, and like, you know, the, the um, hilarious moments and, like, the, you know, crazy shocked moments and the rage moments and stuff, I could have had face cam on during all that. You know, I feel like I missed out on that. Because that's currently the hardest one to play without an emulator in current year. I guess that's true. I mean, it, it's funny that they actually went with that. Because a lot of people were expecting a um, GameCube um, virtual console um, for the Switch. Or what? What is it called again? Class? No, not Classic Edition. That's that's the little, the little tiny console. Um, so is it just like Switch Online, like N sixty four, Genesis or whatever? I, can't, I don't remember if it has a specific name. But yeah, people were just expecting like a, a GameCube thing to happen, and then they were just like, "Ha, ah, Game Boy Advance," and then everybody was like, "Oh, I see." <laughs> I see how it is. Daddy Nintendo does not love me anymore. Also, what was it Moira said? Minecraft? Oh no, I missed it. Hang on, sorry, I'm just going to scroll back up. Not a month ago, I put Minecraft down after several months of focusing on it. I was playing Vault Hunters? Now this is making me want to pick it back up again. What is Vault Hunters? I've never heard of that. Do -do -do -do. Nintendo Switch Online console expansion pack. That is a mouthful. <laughs> they were like, why couldn't they just call it like N64 like virtual console or whatever? Dang it, I am trying so hard not to break these gardens with the food in them. I want to. Here's some frost gardens. It they're taunting me now. I want to get the ingredients for the making of the foodings. Also, I almost walked right by this place. <laughs> oh, man. Ow. Ooh, spooky cave. How, wait, how spooky? Is it uh, just a little spooky? Okay, yeah, it's just a little spooky, not that spooky. Okay, yeah. That's 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 an acceptable amount of spook. We we can accept that. Wait! <laughs> I never actually played Ocarina of Time. I probably should. Oh wait, no, actually, no, I did. I, I played it a little bit on stream, and then never again. Dun 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 dun. dun. So.
sir! Oh! Why? Why does he keep walking over to me? Oh, this isn't the way in. That's also not the way in. Why does he keep walking over to me? I don't want him to walk over me. He freaks me out. Yeah, we're just gonna. Yeah, we're just gonna. Gonna make a, like a boss entrance here. You know, just making our own. Yep. Just gonna yep, walk over this way and then avoid the. Oh my God, that's it. That is it. You have. Mm. Mm. That's it. I, I can't take it anymore. Spider webs. You're. Uh, that's it. Your your number is up. Your days are done, and you're you're dead. You uh, killing all of you. Hey, be quiet over there. You have the audacity to make a uh, kitty cat poo poo over there, and then you make noise. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I I want to kill it. I, I'm not kidding. I want to kill it, but I'd feel bad. <clears throat> it's it's not. It, it's oh my god. It's walking over this way. Oh my god. It's not. You know, I did say, I said no animal killing, but does it count? It's basically a zombie. It's a revenant. Ooh, slime balls. And a, what the heck is a verdant frog light? It looks like a green sea lantern. Oh, and slime blocks. Oh, ooh, now we're in business. Now we're in business. Yeah, I need, I need slime. Oh, froggy. How you doing? You want to leave, don't you? Yeah, you do. You want to leave. Oh. Well, there goes my axe, I guess. You want to leave and be free. Oh, crap. <laughs> the lag. Hey! No, I'm not giving him a hug. Ball Hunters is a pretty neat mod compilation that introduces some level RPG mechanics and randomly generated vaults to explore for loot. I remember I had a mod called, I believe it was called Dungeons, and it would make dungeons, and you could explore these dungeons, and it had, like, several, like, levels and stuff, like, there'd be, you know, like, some easier monsters, like, that spawn on the first level, and then, you know, like, harder monsters that spawn further down and whatnot, um, but, uh, I, I wasn't really feeling that one. You know, obviously it's like a different thing. Oh, these are lightning rods. I've heard of these. Uh, obviously it's like a different mod and it, you know, probably has much different mechanics and stuff from yours, but I, I don't know, it just, it didn't vibe with me. And then there was another one. Um, what was it called? It's, it started with an A. What was it called? Wait a minute. I, I think I might have it in my little... I have, like, a notepad of, um... Of my mods and stuff. Um... I know I've been waiting for Buzzy or Bees to come to 120. So there it is. Uh, I think it was called, like, Advent of Adventure or something? Or maybe... Maybe it was this one. Adventures Structures. That one was, like... That, that would make, like, these huge structures... That would just, like, you, you could go in and, in and explore them, but, like, I, I was just too freaked out. I couldn't. Yeah, okay. I guess it counts. I'll let him live if he's even living. I don't even know if that counts. And lagging again. Stop it. What is going on? <laughs> I friggin, I, I drop down, I take one tiny little half heart of damage, and now the game just like froze. Okay, there we go. Hey, Mechathulu. Good to see you settle in, saw your vlogs, hope you'd be final place so you could be. Thank you, thank you, I appreciate that, Mechathulu. Oh, no! Oh my god, I thought I hit the donkey. No, stop lagging! Try not to hit the donkey, or mule. Oh, it's a mule. Oh, I thought it was a, oh, this is a donkey, okay. My bad. I forgot there's a difference. Donkey. But uh, yeah, it's good to see you again, Mechathulu, and I appreciate the kind words. Thank you, thank you. 
Oh my god, this dog is making me very upset. It's making me upset spaghetti. You know, the funny thing is, I think also another reason why it's probably lagging is because I have shaders on. Um, and funnily enough, if I turn the shaders off, then you're going to see another mod, which is called Distant Horizons. And that is a mod that has been getting insanely popular as of late because it basically makes a pre-rendered vision of what the chunks will look like beyond what your actual field of view is. So you can see way, way, way farther. Like it, it makes it like a really like, you know, like a really like lower uh, quality looking thing, but like from a distance, you really can't tell. And it's just like, it makes it look, it makes the world look so huge. It is fantastic. And I actually forgot to mention that this whole time. I was gonna ask whether or not, hey guys, should I turn off my shaders and show this distant horizons thing? Because I would, I would do that. I would indeed, if you guys are interested. Do I want the eggs? Hmm. Those eggs are not vegan. Not vegan at all. They are in fact, anti-vegan. Here. <gasps> More emeralds. Dang it. Oh, uh. oh, this is the this is the dancing sandwich song. Huh. Work it out, work it out. Alright, well Dragonite's curious, so I guess that means I'm turning shaders off for Oh my goodness, Gracianius. I actually have to get to like a point where I can actually see like the, the edge of the world or the edge of my FLV. Do I? Oh my god. I don't know if I want to keep farming. Like there is just so much crap in here. There's just, it's just there's too much stuff in here. Look at this. There's even more in here. I like I literally I can't even remember now what I looted and what I didn't loot. Oh god. There's so much. <laughs> make it stop. I can't stop collecting. Please make the game stop me from collecting things. Oh, then, then there, there's the farm stuff. Uh, dang it. I wanted the farm stuff that was in here. Oh, there's beetroots. Uh, mm. This is hard. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just do that. Pam's Harvest Craft also has a very convenient uh, function where if you just right click on a matured um, crop, it will automatically replant it. Hmm. I want the mushrooms and the, and the oh wait, I have another weight disc. I don't, I don't want three. I, I, like I literally just need one. Why do I have three? What am I stupid? My, oh my god, okay, this compass thing is freaking me out. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. I, I can't, I can't with the compass. It's just no. <laughs> uh, draw distance probably higher than yours. I think mine is set, set at 16 at the moment. Which is what I usually put it at. I, I, I feel like 16 is a decent number. Actually, you know what? That's, that's a way that I can save some... Save some frames. Yeah, it is on 16. We're on 12. Okie dokie. Right, hopefully that'll make it lag a little less. Uh, how many mushrooms do I have set? Man, I could, I could go for more. Give me mushrooms. Give me mushrooms. Give me mushrooms. Give me mushrooms. Why am I using a shovel for this? I have no idea. Wait, I wasn't I wasn't kidding about what? I, I don't even remember what I said. <laughs> what was I talking about? I remember I said something about Pam's and there being too much stuff, maybe? There, there's just like a ton of stuff. I don't know what mod added this. It might have been supplementals, again. But, uh... Yeah, this is. I mean, there's just so much stuff to frickin' farm. Alright, let's get. I might as well get the beetroot seeds. Uh, 
And let's do oh, dear god. Still lagging a little bit. Just a little bit. From a brief Googling, compass teleport might be a world edit. Yes, I do have that. That's weird. I didn't know it did that. Oh, you must, oh, you probably, I guess you looked it up. I have my, uh, I, I have the simulated, re uh, simulated distance for distant horizon set to 512. So that's um, pretty, pretty far. Although I think that's in blocks, not in chunks. So it's 512 divided by 12. Or 16. Right, yeah, 16. Okay, let me see if I can kind of... Oh, stop it. I could kind of... Oh, this is cinnamon. <gasps> Wait a minute, where's the bone meal? I didn't... Didn't I find bone meal? And then I said, hey, I need bone meal? Oh my god. <laughs> laggy, laggy, laggy. What's this house? What is this? It looks like a barn. What is this? What is that? Oh, mossy block. Okay, cool. Okay. Is that an azalea bush? Yes, it is. It's a flowering azalea. Sweet. Um, oh. Whew. Diamond ores in here. Okay, sure. Why not? I'm not gonna question that. Wow. It just says, <laughs> it just says diamond ores. Cause that's normal, you know, just to put it in a barn. Oh, this is kind of pretty. I like this. Oh, this is. Dang it! I keep thinking that's a way out, and then I'm like, oh wait, that's glass. Can I leave? Oh my god. Apparently, I remember re render distance set to 20. That probably has something to do with why I'm always getting traversal stutter and stuff. Maybe. Is this another snowy blossom grove? Yes, or do yes. I guess I'll just walk in this direction until I can see the edge of my FO... Or not my FOV, my render distance. This is the FOV. This everything you're seeing right now. That's the FOV from left to right. Dang it. Now there's like hills and mountains and trees and stuff, and I can't see the edge. Oh, here we go, here we go. This is perfect. This will be perfect right here. Beep. So share your packs and turn it off and then apply. And then boom, boom. There we go. See? Now I can see all this stuff. And also, oh, that's right. Yeah, so this is, this is outside of the, like, my actual render distance, and it makes them super duper bright. So I will always know when there is an inventory pets cloud in distance. <laughs> just, hey, just look for the extremely bright light in the sky. <laughs> Who likes Gen 4 music? Gen 4 Pokemon music. Oh, I'm, you know what? I'm, no, I don't have any space. I wasn't gonna say anything there. You, you guys were just hallucinating. Yes. Mm -hmm. Do I have brown mushrooms? There's like 20 billion brown mushrooms all around me here, and I could be farming them, but no! No space. I need leather. I need to make a backpack. Which, I don't... So there is a, you know, vegan rules way to get leather, and that is with um, rotten flesh. <clears throat> I have a mod that's literally just called just another rotten flesh to leather mod, and uh, you put rotten flesh in a furnace and it turns it into leather. Um, but I don't know if there's any other way to get leather. I mean, I guess I could try. I do have GEI tools. Leather. Oh, I can get these wing wild and wings. Rabbit hide, that's not vegan. Bonded leather, what the heck is that? Okay. Yeah, there it is, see, this is the... How, did, where does it... Oh, here it is, just J-R-F-T-L. Just another rotten flesh to leather mod. <laughs> I like that, it's J-R-F-T-L. 
Welcome back, Pama. Okay. Thank you, King Cool. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Just got done playing some Platinum. Okay, cool. I remember playing Platinum, and I remember, like... <laughs> I remember, like, a, making, like, the goofiest joke. It was so, like, weird. You know, it was, like, it was so me back then. You know, like, when I first started making YouTube videos, and I was, oh, it tricked me! Um, and I was, uh, first hanging out with, like, Dak and Corey and stuff in Skype calls. And I remember I was playing Platinum, and I remember I was at the point in the game where I was going to, uh, going all around to find all of the plates. <laughs> and I remember I would always make this dumb little joke where I would go, I'm going to get all the plates so that Arceus can be whatever type he wants. And it, for whatever reason, that just, like, took off. And that was just, like, such a big, like... Like, they just loved it. They just loved that I said that. I'm going to get all the plates so Arceus can be whatever type he wants. <laughs> they just, like, I don't know. They, just, they always got a laugh out of them. Um... You could wait for the horse to die of natural causes. But it won't. It's a zombie. Been a long time since the early ABTZ comms. Wow. Warms my heart to see you're back. Hey, Zeta, how's it going? Yes, in the same funny voice, yes. Actually, I think I did it with, like, a lisp. I could get all the all the plate, so I get to be any type you want. <laughs> I don't know why, I don't know, like, I just come up with this stuff. Like, it literally just randomly pops up in my head, and I'm just like, you know what? Let's see if this is funny. And it was. Also, let's put some... Can I... Where's all the... Huh? Okay. Okay, well, first of all, let's organize this a little bit better. This is very poorly organized, sir. I'm sorry. Listen, if you want to stay in this job, you better show some real initiative. Because if you don't, you can find yourself on the way out. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sarah. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. Stop crying. But don't let it happen again. You know, sometimes I just got to put myself in my place, you know? I can keep that there. This, this. Take that. Take... And put that there, and that there, and this. Yeah, we're just gonna leave that like that. Okay. And then boom, bam, bop, boop, 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 bam, boom, bop, boop. Uh, I don't really know where to put these. This is like this is sort of like the rare stuff chest. So yeah, obviously this is gonna go in there. Um, yeah, let's put the mob drops and stuff in here for now. Boop, boop, boop. What am I missing? I'm missing an axe. I don't have an axe. I could use an axe! Three. Wait, did I? Oh, okay. Good one, me. Melody. I like this song. <clears throat> I remember there was there was this version where it's it like the original version that's done in Korean, and then there was like a Japanese version, which was like it was like so much more like big band feeling. It was nice. Oh, my head still hurts a little bit. Oh. I did take an aspirin before the stream, but I mean, I only just took one aspirin. I could have taken more than one. I could have taken seven. But then I probably wouldn't be here doing the stream if I had, so... You know. Dark humor. I'm gonna go farm some food. Oh, and the Gashel Greens. Yeesh. Yeah, I'm gonna... Oh, hey, a Loverly Gashel. Oh, cool. I didn't even know that those spawned uh, off of these. Wow, there's a whole bunch now. Cool, I got three love release. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that would uh, that would be my nickname. 
at that time. <gasps> Whirly Sprig, how you doing, buddy? They used to be called Spriggins. And the... Are you feeling okay? Kind of... Oh, okay, you're kind of stuttering there. Alright, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna leave you alone, then. And just let you do your thing. Um, they used to be called Spriggins before... Um, Ars Novu updated... Was it... I want to say it was, like, from 112 to 116. And then they, like, changed the names of a couple of them. There's, like, three little guys that are... That spawn randomly throughout the world. And there's the Whirly Sprigs, the Starbuncles, which used to be called Carbuncles, and then the Drigmies, which used to be called Drigmies. So, they are cool. I, I love all these guys. Yes, hello. Hello, little friend. Stop, please stop doing that. Why, why are they, like, lagging? <clears throat> it's freaking me out. I can see! I can see! Very far. Do you... So... I think you can breed the chocobos and get different colors. I have... Like, I, I, I looked it up and you can get different colored chocobos. Um... I just never did it. I, I think, like, the only thing I ever did was, like, just tame one. And then I was just like, okay, yeah, I'm gonna go do something else now. <laughs> so maybe I'll actually, you know... Put the uh, put forth the effort. Oh, I see iron. <laughs> the iron, iron, iron. Give me, give me, give me. Get, get me the iron, please. Ba 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 da. I believe they were over here. I think. I. Am ninety percent sure I was in this general area when I saw the choky bows. Oh my gobbledy goodness! Uh, why? Uh, Nothing happened. Nothing happened at all. Nothing. Nada. Mm -mm. I am very sad about this stupid snow mechanic now. Stupid snow. Choky bows? See a whirly spriggy my f Whoa no, please no, no, I'm not falling for that again. Whirly sprig almost baited me into getting sucked down into the snow. There's one! I found one! And it's got a nice big old poofy colorful tail. Hello, you like these, don't you? Yes, you like yummies. Oh, okay. I don't think I tamed it. You like yummies? Oh, hey! Starbuncle. Did I, did I tame it? Because usually it says it in, in the chat or something. Oh, tame fail. There it goes. Okay. Oh, I think that's how you breed them. You breed them with these. I got all day. Don't worry. Yeah, you know, as long as I'm not lagging. Yay. His name is Torobo. I think I need a saddle in order to ride them. So you can't ride them normally. So I guess I'll just put this is where my friend is. Okay, friend is over there. Ooh, a nice blue. Um, what is that called? Uh, um, mm, mm. brilliant archwood log. Like, what was it called? Ah, heck, what is it? Cascading. Dang it. <laughs> I can see. Thoughts on the Pikmin. I can't remember if you've done Pikmin before. Um, I have not. 
I am not a like a, a Pikmin fan or anything. Um, Dak really likes Pikmin, um, but I just I don't know. I never really got into it. I do have a um, when when I was going through all of my stuff um, where uh, you know after we moved, and I was looking for you know making sure I had everything. Um, I found a bunch of my old Nintendo Power magazines. I hate this snow. And one of the uh, Nintendo Power magazines that I found was actually um, when Pikmin 1 came out. It was a special edition, and it had like a special like cover and everything. It had like a, a foreword from Miyamoto and everything. Yeah, it sure did. I, I just, I don't know why I didn't see it coming. I don't know why I didn't see it coming. I think if there's like a, a snow layer on top like this, it's fine. But if it's like this, you can sink it. Yep. Wow. I literally... I just... I was one block! And it sunk me down like five! Oh my god. This is the worst mechanic I've ever dealt with in a video game. I'm exaggerating because there's definitely been worse. But this is just awful. How are you meant to, like, counter that? Do you need snowshoes or something? Do you need to put water on top of the snow? I literally don't know how you're supposed to not sink into the snow. You need leather boots. Oh my god, I have iron. Damn it. Hello, little fox. Oh, this is an example. I can't remember who I was talking to about, uh the uh, animals freaking out when you're not in peaceful mode. So if I... Hang on, sorry. I'm just gonna... Hey! I I didn't hit him, did I? I don't think I hit him. I was just trying... Okay, no, I didn't. Um, so if I turn the difficulty to easy... And yep, there he goes. He is peacing out. He is gone. He is, lo he is gone! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> But then if I put it back to peaceful, and I run back over to him, and he's just, hey, he's chilling. So yeah, I, I don't know why the game does that, but I hate it. I don't, I like being able to hang out with the animals. They are cool, and I like hanging out with them. And I don't want them to run away, with, Rafe, run away from me, because I am not going to harm them. At least not intentionally, you know, like with the stupid the garden I just broke. And I thought I accidentally hit the fox. What does the fox say? That's an oldie. <laughs> oldie but goldie. How many uh, gashels do I have? 18, huh? Oh god, is this the... Is this the in Invincibility Mega Mix that I did? Yes, it is. Well, prepare to listen to this for the next 10 minutes. Yes, he done zooped. Oh, also, no. Well, yeah, you need to tab back into that, and then tab back out to that, and then we're over here. Oh my god, I just realized! I need to put this here. Because you guys this whole time have not seen the fact that I have a mini-map on the top right that has been showing me everything. <laughs> Whoops! All right, see you later, Myra. Thank you for stopping on by. Thank you for your generosity. I really, really, really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Um, wait, where is? Oh, it's gonna go back home. Um, but yeah, that was uh interesting. I I don't know why, because when uh, when I noticed it was on the top right, I was like, that doesn't seem right, but it also doesn't look like bad, so I'm just gonna keep it there. And then I forgot about the the, the map. <laughs> Whoops. Pfft. 
Um, I remember I had some set-in rules. What the heck did I just do? Oh my god. Some set-in rules of when I would switch it from peaceful to easy. And I believe it was when I had my first spell book from Ars Novu and a full um, um, magic armor thing. Magic armor suit. <laughs> Early 2010 songs are old as yep, anything. Well, actually, so there was actually an interesting thread that I saw on Reddit asking about when, like, how long do you consider a game to be out before it's considered retro or considered a classic? And I think most people agreed on 15 years, which I, you know, yeah, I, I can see that. Because then by that point, the system itself would long stop being sold. The games themselves would stop long being sold, or being produced even. And so, yeah, I, th I think I think 15 years is a pretty good rule of thumb. So anything from anything from now 2009, from and and, and earlier is or later, right? Yeah, 2009 or later is a. Uh, is now retro. So Mario Kart Wii is now a retro game. Let that sink in. The first Just Dance is retro. <laughs> yeah, I guess that would count. I really need to fill this damn water bucket with water. Water bucket with water. Because right now it's just a regular bucket that does not have water in it. But I would like for it to become a water bucket. That said, I remember reading a study a while ago about what do people think constitutes the good old days when agreement seemed to be whatever it was 30 years ago. Um, listen, I can actually think of 30 years ago, okay, because I'm old. Um, and the good old, I mean, I mean, for me, it was the good old days because all I had to do was go to school and, you know, you know, I didn't have to, like, make food or dress myself or do my own laundry or pay bills or worry about having money. You know, those definitely were the good old days. Those were, uh, those were fantastic days, honestly. Yeah, you know, I got to, I got to hang out with my, my friends at school and, you know, go to, um, PE and... What was, um, how old was I? I think. Uh, 30 years ago, it was 20, or 1994. So 1994, okay, so. Yeah, so I would have gone to PE and I would have, yeah, I would have had like my cool teachers and, you know, it's like just not having to worry about anything. No cooking, not even the microwave. You know, it's funny though. I mean, when I was young, my mom did actually teach me how to cook. Um, you know, simple stuff at first, you know, how to make scrambled eggs, how to make grilled cheese, you know, stuff like that. Um, and after a while, you know, I, I realized, you know, I actually do kind of like cooking. Because my mom and my dad were both chefs. My mom went to, um, college. She went to, uh, what was, what was that really, like, famous cooking college? Um, she went to that one. She didn't complete it, unfortunately, but she did go to that. Um, and then my dad, like, all he ever did was... I poured on blue. Um, crap, maybe? It's, I'm, mm, I don't know, it's not ringing a bit. I, like, I, I swear, it had something with a B. So may, maybe it was the CIA. All right, I don't like you. Um... And all my dad ever did for a um, career was cook. Like, he, he had, like, just, like, cooking jobs, like, at, like, a ton of different restaurants. CIA. <laughs> what the heck? Leave. <laughs> Get out. The door's that way. God, I'm so torn now. Do I want to go back and farm more of this crap? No, I do not. I, d I do not. I don't want to farm this crap. No, no, no crap farming. Oh, <laughs> okay. Well, I, I'm not familiar with it, so no, that was not it. 
<laughs> I mean, I thought you were memeing with me. I thought you meant like the CIA, like the spy agency. Like, yeah, that's that's cooking. She's definitely cooking. Cooking up some spy magic. Um, can these, you know, um, get matured a little bit more? Because I need them. Oh, that's what I need. I need... That's what I need to find. Yeesh. Okay, that'll, that'll be my first... Actually, you know what? Let's do this. Boop. Oh, no cheeky in that. Um, that'll be my first mission. I'm gonna find a Badlands. Or a Mesa, or whatever it's called now. Yes, the cooking was just a cover job. Yep. <laughs> yes, indeed. Yeah, let, me, let me just do it from here. Is it called Badlands? Yeah. Oh my god, that is far away. What the... Oh my god. <laughs> That's really far. 6,000 blocks. Oh. Oop. Well, maybe I can... Maybe I'll get into some wacky adventures along the way. What is it now? Midnight? Wow. How long have I been streaming? Does it say? Oh, two and a half hours. <laughs> it's right there. Dee -dee. Hey, Adorbson, how's it going? We are just playing some Minecraft, and by we, I mean me. I don't have a server open or anything. I, I was thinking about that, you know, I was like, if I play Minecraft on stream, maybe I should, you know, do yield. I'm opening up a stream, hey, everybody come join, and... Or, I mean, I'm opening up a server, everybody come join the stream server. But, I didn't. At least not yet. I'm thinking for like the next stream, I, I would like to maybe play some more Mario Kart 8 or something. Some Mario Kart 8 and... Um... Oh, Jackbox! I was, I was like, what do I usually play on streams? <laughs> Jackbox. I remember I got the... Well, it was new at the time. Oh my god, I need more space now. This is awkward. Um, I remember I was playing, it was new at the time, or not playing, but I had just gotten, it was new at the time, the, um, Jackbox 8, and now it's up to 10. Yeah, it's been a while. God, this one's such a banger. Super Mario Strikers Charged Invincibility. <clears throat> it's, it's... It's crazy to me, like, the style that Super Mario Strikers had, or at least Charged had. And it had, like, that sort of, like, that, you know, that... All, all the art was, like, that inky, um... Inky sort of, like, you know, sketchy, um, you know, like, kind of dirty art. And, you know, it just, it like, it made it, like, you know, seem like a, like a really cool game. And then, you know, like, the in-game in stuff was actually kind of kind of hype, too, you know? Like, you had, like, characters that were doing, like, this crazy crap. Like, Waluigi's, like, Super Strike or whatever was, you know, he, he had, like, a huge, like, rose whip. And he would just whip the ball. And, um, yeah, like, Bowser's was, like, he, he turned into, like, this, like, demon. Like, not like, I mean, it kind of looked like Giga Bowser, but, man, it was, like, it was, like, cool. Not to say that Giga Bowser's not cool, but it was just like, you know, it was like Bowser, but cool. And, um, was Peach had like angel wings, like that one was really cool. Daisy just like punched the crap out of the ball. Um, who else was it? Yoshi had like the, I think Yoshi grew like wings as well and like did like the fire blast from like Super Mario World. Uh, Mario, I think Mario just did like a general like kick, just like a super kick. Diddy Kong's was weird. Diddy Kong's was like, I have now found the peace within myself. And then the ball just shoots towards the goal. 
So I think with uh, the, the the Mario Kart, er, the Mario Strikers that came out like what, like a year or two ago, I don't think it like really captured that same kind of essence. And I just one after it came out, I just never heard anything about it. So I don't think anybody really paid any attention to it. No lie, I was thinking about Mario Party session today. Uh, well, it's too late now. <laughs> it's just, yeah, but Mario Party would be a fun, uh, fun stream game. Fall Guy. Oh no! Fall Guys. Um, it's been a long time since I played Fall Guys. Uh, I haven't played it since like season two. And from everything, <laughs> from everything I understand, it's not going so great. The um, the the community is not happy. Ha happy. The, com the community is not happy. I know, I, I saw you say falling, and I put the ing there at the end. Happying. <laughs> that was, uh... That was something. That was kind of terrifying, I'm not gonna lie. I, like, I genuinely had no idea what I was gonna land on. <laughs> at first, you know, and then I looked down and saw the water. I think, even with peace, Peaceful, I think I genu genuinely would have died there. We woo, oh, we whoa, we whoa, we whoa, we whoa. Why is that so fun to say? Why am I like this? And this is humongous. This is ridiculous. This is crazy how much crap there is here. And by crap, I mean ice. Oh, hey, polar bear. How you doing? What do we got there? I can't really tell. God, like the Distant Horizons mod, like it makes it look so like, I don't know, like so flat. And like smooshed t together when I zoom in. So I have really no idea what I'm looking at. Is that not the sound made when you get a shout out message? Oh, it was um, <clears throat> when I got uh, bits. Uh, bits on, on Twitch. Whoa! And then the, um, yeah, that, that was another thing I tested the other day. So I'm really familiar with those right now. Uh, when I get a donation, you know, it was me going, if you like my voice, that's a plus two. And then what was the other thing? Oh, the follower is the. Do 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 do. One up sound. I remember it was it, I initially like before I had the those Mario gifts. It was the the, the Sylveon dancing. Oh oh. Hmm. Hmm. Eh. Hmm. Hmm. Electro noises. Hmm. Huh. What in the world is that? What am I looking at? What is that? What in the world is going on there? Help. Fro oh my god, this is a deep frozen ocean. Like, frozen ocean, like, it just makes me clench. Um, <clears throat> there was a server that, uh, we, uh, <clears throat> by we, I mean me and, like, some IRC people played on. Um, a few years back, and I will never forget that I was boating over a frozen ocean at one point, and there was a damned ocean monument that I didn't realize was there, and I believe I swam right over it, and as I'm, like, going through, you know, like, all these icebergs and stuff like this, the stupid Elder Guardian jump scare popped up in my face, and, like... <laughs> I literally, like, I jumped. Like, my whole my whole mouse went like this when it happened. It was, oh my god. It was bad. That's one, isn't it? Yes, it is. There it is, ladies and gem. Ladies and germs. It's, it's, that, that's the thing. That's the thing I was telling you about. Luckily, we're in peaceful mode. I don't have to worry about it. Oh my god. Lag Lagaroonie. You. I don't like you. I don't like you! No! No! Why is this so deep? Good god. That is very deep. 
Look at it's on stilts. That's how deep this friggin' ocean is. Good God. No. Yes, I, I did. I did mention this at length earlier in the stream. If you would have been here, Dragonite. I mean, God, unbelievable that you're just not paying attention, you know, 24-7 every single second of the day of what I'm doing, and you're over there doing other stuff that's not this. I'm just talking about how Minecraft freaks me out. And, uh, yeah, it's about as much, yeah, pretty much that's what I said, as much horror as I'm capable of taking. Um, the Hypixel stream was interesting. Um, I, I do, I like Hypixel, but I haven't been on Hypixel in a super long time. Oh my god, I'm about to fall off the edge here because the world is refusing to load. So now I get to sit here and wait. Um, yeah, maybe you're always in big trouble. You know, what, what, what what's the difference? Um... The only thing with the high pixel was, I think at one point wasn't I just like playing with Sev? I think it was like I think it was just like Sev was just playing with me and like nobody else. I feel like that was it. It was just Sev. Oh my god, another one, another one. I hate you. 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 Ugh. This feels like Truman Show right now. Yep. I, I don't know that I'm being broadcasted right now. I am, uh... There's just millions and millions of people watching me right now. Yep. That will be crazy. <laughs> I, I, like, I, you know, I mean, I've thought... Another one? I'm, li I'm literally just going in one direction, and it just spawns another one on the way. I have thought about it many, many a time. I always, I always wonder, like, you know, what would have happened if I actually did become like a huge YouTuber or like a huge streamer or something? I don't even know what I would do with all that popularity. I mean, I'm just like, I'm comfortable where I'm at right now. I think I have a very, very, very good um, community and um, you know, group of people that watch and hang out and, you know, are hanging out with me in, on Discord and stuff. <clears throat> but, um, man, like, I, I literally, I couldn't even, like, imagine. Like, I, I go and I, I will watch, oh, 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 an uh, inventory pet spawner. I will go and watch, um, you know, like, the big U uh, big streamers or whatever, and I'm just like, man, I'm just watching their chat, and I'm just like, how do they even deal with this, bro? <laughs> how do you even deal with this? Hey, it's a saddle pet. Luckily, there's no spawns, so there will not be any spiders spawning in here. Get into all the clubs and rack up all those. I'm good. I am not a club person. I would rather... Oh, a village? I would rather spend the night at home having ordered in with, like, Uber Eats and just, like, watching a movie by myself rather than go to a club. I, I I am just, I am not a clubs person. I am not a crowd. Can I get this boat? Can I be a pick up the boat person? <clears throat> I am, um, yeah, I, I just, I, I don't, I don't do that. <clears throat> a Jane sized YouTuber. Listen here, you. You're gonna be in big trouble if you make that reference one more time. You hear me? <laughs> But, uh, yeah, I mean, aside from the fact that it's a very dated reference, um, you're not even spelling it right. It's actually LKG Jane. Is this another tavern? Oh, my God, this is so pretty. Oh, man, I love birch. Does it have an upstairs like the other one? Upstairs, upstairs, upstairs. Where are you, upstairs? Upstairs. Where are you, upstairs? Hello? Upstairs? Oh, oh, wait. Oh, oh, dang. Oh. Wow, stuff. And I'm, I'm gonna take that too. He, sweet. Uh... <laughs> Only club I'm talking. You know, I never actually played Club Penguin. I I've seen like 
plenty of stuff on Club Penguin. I remember at, at one point I was subbed to the subreddit, um, R, I think it was like R banned from Club Penguin, and it was just like, what, like, stuff that, like, people did that got them banned. And, you know, most of the time it was bad words. Oh, it's Starbuncle. Hey, how you doing, buddy? A little green one. I love how they come in different colors. Antohony. Mm. Mm. Now that's, that's, yeah, that's, that's gonna, that's a big trouble. That just got you one big trouble point, mister. I hope you've been keeping track of how many big trouble points you have, because I certainly have not. I, I don't even think I could count that high. I'm gonna farm all this hay bale. Yeah, and I never played to Toontown either. I remember seeing commercials for it. I remember seeing commercials, you know, when it was, like, new. Uh, on Cartoon Network. There was commercials for Toontown and stuff. But I, just, I never got into it. I, I never... I don't think I ever really like, even downloaded it or tried it. Hello? Game? Game o lame -o? Bang, 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 bang on it. Bang, 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 bang. Hey, Zach, how's it going? I'm uh, currently frozen in Minecraft, apparently. I literally subscribed to their club newsletter thing and got some neato cards and stuff, such. That's cool. I Well, I mean, I was gonna also mention Webkins, <laughs> obviously. Did Webkins ever have anything like that? You know, oh, I, there was one thing that I that I did um, get into for a very short time. And it was very new. Neopets. I remember I had a knee. Did I have like two? Wait, did, could you have more than one? Because I feel like I had like two or three Neopets or something. I think you could have like three at once or something. Uh, I might be misremembering. It's been a long time. Long, a long time. Also, what is this? It's like a little outpost or something. What the? Oh my god, it's like a pillager outpost. Oh, gross. I will set you free. Is this name? Oh, Yi. I thought his name was Yes. That's also an interesting name. Yi. Alrighty. Well, only 2,000 more blocks. Oh, I need a boat. Boat, boat, boat. Where'd my boat go? Hang on. Give me my boat back. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna leave this here. I'm just gonna... Oop, oop, yep. Looks natural. Alright. The one... Oh, I mean, I don't remember any of the, like, individual Neopets. I... I remember I was trying to go for a specific one, but I just don't remember what specific one that was. Is this another Yellowstone? Oh my god, it is, isn't it? Oh my god, it is. Oh god, my boat's about to go crazy. Alright, we're out of that now. <laughs> Kiko. The, the name sounds... It, it's like it, it like kind of unlocked like a little memory that was tucked away for a very long time. That name does sound familiar. Is that red sand? Yes, it is. Hey! Stop lagging! Another Yellowstone. There's another game that I played. Um... Pena slash Super Swing Golf slash Albatross 18, which I, I remember in, so the Pena was the original name for it, I think in the Korean version and uh, the Southeast Asian versions, where I, th um, I, w I don't remember like what game service I was playing on, but it was definitely called Pengyo when I played it. 
but the Amer like the North American or maybe like the Western game uh, producers or whatever, um, um, pu not, not publishers, whatever. Anyway, um, in the English version, it was called Albatross 18. But for whatever reason, I could not get Albatross 18 to work on my computer. I tried time and time and time again, and it just refused to open. Like it, I don't, I think it installed fine, it patched, and then it just wouldn't open. And so I was just stuck playing, you know, Pena, which is it's the same exact game, but I'm just playing with people from different countries now. Um, and then when they, then when they ported it to the Wii, it was Super Swing Golf. Oh no. This is a lot of snow. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh. <laughs> oh. I got out. I got out. I got out. Ooh. Big mushroom. Where am I? Oh, dark forest. A.K.A. Rood forest. Da 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 Ooh! Pretty. A high- Oh, a highland! Highlands are cool. God! I was gonna say, yeah, highlands are usually, you know, high up. As you can tell by the name. I'm 147 blocks up right now. Oh my god. Where sea level is 100 and- er, sea level is 63 blocks. I'm at 148 right now. Oh, a goat! What's the- oh, the goat is vanilla? I didn't know they added goats. It's cute. The lag is not cute, though. You know, every time I'm lagging, I'm seeing, like, a message on my OBS, and it's just, like, something about, like, f like frames dropped or whatever. So, I, yeah, it's definitely the stream. What's that? Looks like a taiga, but, like, a hilly taiga, a mountainous taiga. Do, da, dee, do, do, do. I mean, yeah, like that—that that was my thing too. I, I was just trying to go for like the cutest one, but I don't remember which one it was. Maybe, maybe if I like saw like um, like a, an image or whatever, or, like all of the Neopets that like existed, or like maybe the ones that you could get to start with, maybe I might recognize it. I—I want to say it was something that was blue. I could be wrong. I don't know. Ooh. Oh, it's a Jade Cliffs. Oh, this is actually kind of a rare biome. Jade Cliffs are cool. Oh, I like Jade Cliffs. Oh, whoa, what's happening there? Distant Horizons? You feeling okay? What is happening there, bro? <laughs> Somebody help that biome. Now. Yeah. If I could ever, like, make it over this Jade Cliffs, that'd be, like, fantastic, I'd imagine. Just, you know, it, in case it felt like being nice to me and stuff. Okay, here we go now. We're kind of... And we're kind of hitting the peak. The peaky... Peaky, peaky, peak. You ever just wake up feeling like that? Somebody help the biome? Is that what you're saying? Like, somebody help me? Is that what you're saying? Whoa, what is that? Is that uh, emeralds? What's happening there? Oh, this is awesome. This is cool. Ah! This is, this is still just the Jade Cliffs? Oh, this is, man, this is cool. Emeraldos. Yes, please. I remember one of the Pixelmon servers that I used to play on, um, I donated to them and I got like a donor rank. <laughs> and if you got like a certain donor rank, you could go to the donor mines. And it was like this constantly like respawning just huge mass. T a huge like tangled mass of like a, just a 
big, huge cubic area of different ores. And it was just like all like mishmashed together. Like you, you'd find, you know, iron next to redstone, next to emeralds, next to coal, next to diamonds, next to lapis. Um, and then, you know, you'd have the occasional stone, just kind of break it up a little bit. But I, if this is just like reminding me of that. <laughs> just like, there, you know, there's a huge like stony area and then there's just like ores that are just like popping up from the, uh, at the, on the top block. <clears throat> I remember there was a. I remember I recorded a video of myself in there, and there was like a, it was like donors that like they had just recently donated or something, and they could not get into the donor mines. So, I the recording was me farming in the donor mines, and a bunch of people like standing outside of the, um, outside of the like uh limit like the it was like a invisible force field or whatever. That like pushed out any of the uh, the uh, the proletariats <laughs> that that didn't uh, donate and couldn't afford to get into the donor mines, <laughs> and they were just standing there watching me farm all the ores. <laughs> that was a good recording. Also, what is this now? I don't think I found a single like actual village so far. I found oh, oh crap. I found the witchy mansion or villa. The, the witchy town, witchy hut, village, or whatever. And now whatever this thing is. Oh, and the taverns. And then whatever this is. This is probably another witchy village, villa. All the spider webs and stuff. What the fricky frack? What is going on in here? What is this? Oh, it's a, oh, it's a mine colonies thing. Oh, cool. You're yeah, just giving me a free town hall. Well, well, well. Mine Colonies is, is another fun mod. That's, um, it, you... Basically, you make, like, your own, like, little Sim City sort of town, and, like, people start spawning in, and, you know, they they want to join your town, and you, like, you can, like, give them jobs and places to live and stuff like that. It's fun. Back when there was Minecraft 1.8, there was a wonderful world generation feature where you could customize the spawn rates of ores. I remember that. They got rid of that. Wow, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't know they, they got rid of that. I remember you could do that. I remember you could change like, you could change like s diamonds to spawn at like Y like sixty three or whatever. You could you could change like, s you could make it so that there was like no stone that would ever spawn, or you could make it so that there like coal would never spawn and stuff like that. Yeah, that I remember I used that a couple times. It was actually. Very handy. Okay, so now we're in a moor. I found a, uh, a banana tree. And what do we got here? Light cheese. And what do we got here? Oh, cinnamon. I bet I could tell all these fruits from a distance because I'm so smart. What is that? What's that? That's a grapefruit. Oh. There it is. Encoding overloaded. Consider turning down the video settings or use a faster encoding preset. <gasps> Durians. My favorite Super Mario Sunshine fruit. Haha. <laughs> Not really. Wow, we this is very cliffy. I don't remember clover patch clover patches being this high up, but you know. That's tectonic for you. <clears throat> that's crazy. I didn't think that they got rid of that. Because <clears throat> I remember, oh, you know what it was? I, I actually got rid of, um, I, I made it so that diorite, andesite, and granite would never spawn. Because they're like my three least favorite blocks in the entire game. Also, hi, Luck. How's it going? Ooh, black sand. Oh, this is a volcanic plains. This is another rare biome. This is cool. <clears throat> Wait, was that the place that I was just at? Yeah. What is that? <gasps> a waystone. A waystone. It's a way back home. It's a way waystone. It's a way back home. It's my w what in the world just hit me?
Maybe I stepped on like a spiky plant or something? <clears throat> Just launched my stupid face forward. It's a way, way stone. And I don't have space. Oh my god. Stupid me. Um, ooh. Jungle. I'm the only one who does like the iron. <sighs> you know, like the polished blocks look okay, but they're just not my cup of tea. What is going on there? Why are those colored like that? God, this is awesome. This is a huge volcanic plains. I remember I, I had another seed um, that I, I played like a few months back. And I had a volcano, the volcanic plan, volcanic plains that was like this big. <laughs> it was like, it was like 16 blocks by like 5 blocks. It was ridiculous. This is a biggie. I like this. Oh my god. Again, somebody, somebody help that biome. <laughs> It's a way, way stone. It's a way home. Amethyst rainforest. That is awesome. What is it? What added this? Oh, Terralith. Cool. Yeah, I'm really not. So, it's like, Terralith is uh, something that I really only added recently. So, oh, Coco. So, I, I'm not really familiar with any of the. Terralith biomes. Oh my god. I'm, I'm gonna get rid of that stupid... Cross... Or not... Yeah, the crossbow. <laughs> the crossbow. Not the crossbow. Yeah, the crossbow. Woohoo! Does anybody like my Waystone song? Type, type W in the chat if you like my Waystone song. It's a way, way stone. It's a way home for me. Oh my god, I need pumpkin. Or do I? I'm just gonna say yes. Because <laughs> it's food. Oh dear, I don't see any W's in the chat. I'll have to work on it then. Oh god, oh dear god. This is a very apt song to be playing at this time. Do, do, do. This was a song from Fly for Fun, aka Fliff. And, um. <laughs> I don't really know how to explain the area that it plays in, other than it's just furry town. And it's basically just a bunch of furry characters that all live in the same town under a big, ginormous tree. And it's just got such funky, funky music. And it's just like being in like that bamboo forest just made me think of that. Hot shrubland. Okay. Oh, I'm almost there. Hot Shrubland. Weird. That Shrubland is so hot. Do, 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 do. Oh, what the? Oh, drip leaves? Yeah. Usually these are in the water. Actually, oh no, I think usually they're underground. Oh, melon. We don't have melon. My cat was making noise. I'm going to get rid of the arrows. Goodbye arrows, you will not be missed. Goodbye you arrow butts, you are so stink. Oh, I just realized I came here to farm at Terracotta, and now I don't have any space. Be quiet! Nobody asked you. Quick, come hold hold some of my stuff. 
Hold some of my stuff in Minecraft. Can you hold the melons in the... What did I get? Iron ores. Can you hold iron ores? No, you're just gonna come over here. You can come over here, yeah. <laughs> oh, there's not... Hey! I thought Quark added the... There was like an auto-walk function. Well, Mittens, unfortunately, made some uh, brown terracotta blocks earlier. So, you know, I don't know if I can ever forgive her for that. More cocos and cocos and cocos. I'm gonna put them in my cereal. Has that ever been done before? Has anybody ever just, like, broken up chocolate and put it in cereal? I might be onto something. What about... What if somebody put chocolate chips in cereal? That'd be kind of cool. Okay, now I have to get rid of something else. I guess I'll just get rid of this. Singulars. No. No! No! <laughs> Why does the game have to do that when I have no space? Why does it have to give me a desert pyramid? Mittens is disgusted that this happened. Absolutely disgusted. Disgusting. Zero. Well, not. I mean, not literally zero space in my inventory. I could get rid of some stuff. But with a full inventory, the game is just like, hey, you know what? You could use a desert pyramid. Yeah, thanks, game. Very, very cool. Thanks. Very, very cool. Awesome. Good. Do I cry? Should I cry? I want to cry. I feel like crying. Maybe, maybe just a little cry. Let me just get a full stack. Boom, boom. And over by the sticks. Hit the sticks! My nose is itchy. Bro, these air- I forget where corn spawns from. It better not be from arid deserts. Or air gardens, I mean. <laughs> arid desert. <clears throat> oh my god. Well, maybe I'll mess up dropping down there and everything will explode and I'll lose it all anyway, so. And, you know, and die. Well, let's see what we got here. Uh, oh, that's right, I have no no inventory space, I can't pick that up! Oh my god. Oh, I should have used the water bucket. Too late. Yep! Oh, a backpack! No way. No way. No way. There's no way. The game taketh away, and the game giveth. That is beautiful timing. You have got to be kidding me. Now I have space! I don't want this garbage. No, get get this out of here. Get, get this nonsense out of here. Out. Out the door. Goodbye. The game taketh, the game giveth. Absolutely wonderful. Oh my god. Now I have all the space. Oh 
Wow, that is just fan freaking tastic. <clears throat> Should I farm the TNT? I don't know if I even need. Because I never actually use TNT, but I wonder if it's, there's like a recipe. Bomb Bay. Oh, it's an aircraft oven. Drops TNT, does not destroy blocks, but deals heavy damage. Huh. No, what can I make with TNT? Oh. A bomb? A bomb bay. A cover. And a minecart with TNT, even though there's already a minecart with the TNT recipe. Oh, what's this? Cliff of Explosion. A blacksmith can make a bomb. Fletcher can also make a bomb. And a mechanic can make a minecart with TNT. Eh. Yeah, I mean, especially true for me, because I just, you know, I have a tendency to collect literally everything and never get rid of anything. I know, it's it's a character flaw, but, you know, I, I, I is what I is. I can barely see here, good God. I don't even know if I'm, like, making it up through a... Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Boop, boop, bit. Alright, sweet. And now I have to dig my way out, I guess? Yeah. Bing, 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 You know what? That's... Yeah, that's something I should also farm now that I'm here. Might as well get some sand. Some sand. Oh, man! I'm gonna shove the sand in my pants. I'm going to get really irritable, irritable, irritable-ated. Who's that? Is that a bunny? Oh, a bunny. Who's that hopping over here? <laughs> this is a no-hopping zone. I, I like that, that just the timing on that is absolutely fantastic. I, I literally thought, like, I mean, I was going to go into the pyramid and I was just gonna like see what was in the chests and then maybe just kind of like pick and choose what I wanted to take now and then maybe like come back later and then get the rest but like man the timing on that backpack was just absolute god tier oh I didn't move with the waystone two waystones <laughs> I'm happy now <laughs> I'm very happy now. I, I like that's actually so rare. Oh, great. No, I don't want that. Uh, I don't want cut sandstone. Nobody wants cut stance sandstone. Literally, there's never been a, anybody in the history of forever that has ever wanted cut sandstone. That that is a hundred percent true. I anybody that says otherwise is lying. I'm telling you the truth. I'm me. Just me. Nobody else. Okay, we're gonna... Oh, I got bones, too! Oh, my am rotten flesh. Oh, we're... Mm -mm. We're moving now. We're moving and grooving. Not just one, but both. Oh, oh, oh. oh I have no more space. <laughs> That's upsetting. Um, no, I don't want sand. Actually, you know what? I can use the sandstone in in lieu of sand, or er, in, in lieu of stone, can't I? Sandstoner. Yep. Uh, well, what's that? Yes, I can. Oh, I thought it started raining. Boo doo boo doo boo doo. Doobie doobie doo. Isn't this the Sky Arrow Bridge? <laughs> Another waystone, no floopin' way. Yes, it was the Sky Arrow Bridge. Oh, I just extended the window? Did it, did it, that, that like mess up the resolution on the stream? Okay, whatever, it just kind of stretched out a little bit. <laughs> just have a little stretch, you know? This is... What was this town called? Shandar? Is it Shandar?
Shamar? Shamar, Shamar. But I do 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 do. Well, it's just another 5,000 blocks to get back home, guys. Here we go. <laughs> Oh, this is, um, I, I remember what mod added this. I just don't remember the name of the mod. <laughs> I remember getting it, though. It was, like, a mod that just kind of makes, like, little, like, random, like, little structures. Just, you know, just to kind of liven things up a little bit. Oh, 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 God, look at those jade clips in the background. That looks so fantastic. <clears throat> That is like, that is like the one, I guess not the one reason, but like, you know, like the, the biggest reason to get Distant Horizons is that I can just see all of those jade cliffs from all the way over here. That is so cool. Now, if I zoom in on it, it's going to look like crap, but, <laughs> oh my God, but when it looks, you know, vanilla, it looks fantastic. Yeah, the, the color of the water is very nice. Hello, little parrot. How you doing, buddy? Do I have something that you might like? Do you like these? Do you like eating these? No, you don't like those. Um, I kind of want a parrot. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. Can I get him in one? Can I get him in one? I did not get him in one. And he's flying. Can I get him in two? I did not get him in two. Can I get him in three? Come on. Come on, baby. Baby! Nope, I did not get him in three. Oh dear. This is looking uh, mighty, mighty troublesome. <clears throat> you better be worth it, mister. Four. Five? There we go. Oh, hey. On my shoulder. On my shoulder! Get on my shoulder. Get on my shoulder. That's, that's not how you get on my shoulder, is it? You have to be sitting. You have to be sitting first. I need kind of, if I could, I mean, sort of, how do I... Get you on my shoulder. There we go. I got a pal. I just have to remember not to jump. And I'm immediately going to jump. By that I mean I'm gonna fall. <clears throat> okay. That's um concerning. All right, bird. Um, can you? Let's just have you wait out here. I'm just gonna have you sit. Yeah. Have you wait right there? Okay. Oh, hello. How we doing here, folks? It's me, Mr. The Playing with Moe. Back again for another some sort of modded desert temple, or I mean, a uh, jungle temple. Modded ju jungle temple. Oh, there's a spider spawner. Fortunately, they will not spawn. This is a lot of spiderwebs. <coughs> Parrot pal. Any relation to PayPal? Yes, I believe I will accept some diamonds. Why not? Since you're being so incredibly generous to me, game, I don't know what's happening, but I am very happy that it is happening. Oh my God, I was actually listening to this song yesterday. <clears throat> now on this playlist, there was um, it was a YouTube video. It was like um. It was like all, it was like calming Pokemon music, but it's all Gen 3. And I remember looking to see <clears throat> whether or not this song was on there, and it was. <laughs> Arrow of Slowness. Is this like, is this Trap Traps now, or? Whatever. Or I mean, it, I'm. I mean, is the trap sprung now? Is it gonna shoot again? Oh my god, are you kidding me? 
goodness gravy. What an absolutely fantastic adventure this has been. Parrot, help me up. Grab me. Grab my hand. Oh, don't just look at me. Oh, dang it. Parrot's not helping. Um. There we go. Oh, that was easy, huh? Alrighty, off we go. Right? How do I get you back up? There we go. Now, if I go downstairs, he shouldn't fall off my... Oh, crap. I was going to say, I probably have to go really slowly down the stairs. No, oh, get back here. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to boat this guy. Why do you... Why do you love going to this spot? Like, it's... Like, this spot in particular, you just have to keep going back to. What is it with this spot? Do you have, like, a nest here? Like, what is this? Get on my shoulder. And now we're getting in the boat. Okay, we're going, we're gonna go home. Oh, I need to, no, oh, whoops. Um, I need you to not be on my shoulder now. I need to push you into the boat. So I need to sit, okay. And then I need you to go in like that. Come on. And then there we go. And then we're on our way. <clears throat> very, very long way. A whole, what is this, like 50 blocks? Great. <laughs> Wonderful. This is going to be an absolute nightmare getting this guy back. I, oh, hey, it's another one of those weird pillager outposts. What do we got here? Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Ooh. I remember during the... Uh, oh, I need stone bricks, actually. I remember during the um, Super Mario Odyssey playthrough, and... I kept referencing a specific YouTube video um, <clears throat> where he actually came back and started making videos again, which is nice. But, but um, this was during the you know edgy, edgy period, and uh, and I remember one specific point of this video that I was referencing. <laughs> Just. It was a it was a My Little Pony um, it was a My Little Pony uh, G4 YouTube poop and I remember it was at one point where Gilda was the the episode where Pinkie Pie throws a birthday party for Gilda and Gilda says in the video don't mind if I don't I, it's just so like. I absolutely just love that quote. I don't know why, but it's just such a funny quote. And I just couldn't get enough of it. And I just, I, I, I remember I was saying it in the Odyssey playthrough in the um, Snow Kingdom, I think it was. I think, I think it was the Snow Kingdom. Oh my god, it was so funny. <laughs> don't mind if I don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you remember that? Nice. Oh, okay, good. He did warp. Thank God. <clears throat> I was like, if he doesn't warp, I I don't know what to tell him. It's it's, it's over. It's, it's over for this guy. I I really want this. I really want this parrot because um, it's gonna be a tribute to my grandma. Um. My grandma's whole thing was, she was really, really, really into parrots. She had like, like these like old, like antique plates with parrots on them. And she had like, you know, ki like ki stuff for the kitchen with parrots on them. And she had um, like parrot pins and, and like parrot uh, shirts and, and dresses and earrings. And like, she was so into parrots. And the reason being was that because her nickname, which she sort of took on as like a pseudonym, was Polly. So, you know, Polly, the parrot. So she was like super, super, super into parrots. And if I could get this guy, what the heck? Oh, <laughs> I thought he like froze in midair. <laughs> oh, this game just froze. If I could get this guy in here, that'd be fantastic. Um... But yeah, I, I would love to have the hello. Now, dang it. 
This is uh, this is so hard. Oh my god. This is like so much harder than like a a cow or you know like a sheep or whatever we're trying to bring home. Like this is just <laughs> it's the fact that it flies. There's a point where I kept saying that to myself while I was going through life. Don't mind if I don't. It's so funny. Like I, I don't know. It's just like it's. it's it, I love like YouTube poops that are just like stuff that's just like sim simplicity sort of funny. Like it's. I love surreal humor. That's why I love Space Ghost so much because like Space Ghost was just like it, it was like one of the like original like surreal humor type of uh, shows. But, like, when it's just, like, simple stuff like that, you know, like, just, just repeating the same word in a way that just sounds so absurd, and yes, that rhymes, I, it just, it, it gets me. It, it, this, I love that. There was, what was the other thing? Um, I think I included it in the uh, in that Skype Big Lols compilation, which I believe I have now privated, because, uh... Well, it, let's just say that's dated. Um, but yeah, there was a, another video from the same guy um, that me and Dak and Corey were watching. And, uh, and I'll never forget, it was, um, it was a Sweetie Belle saying, We're here! Rear! <laughs> like, we would actually unironically say that in calls. I'm here! Rear! Um, and then there was a there was a YouTube poop that I found on my own, um, that like YTP'd like a much later uh, My Little Pony episode from season five, um, where they, they literally said that it was uh, another character that shows up later talking in Twilight it says Twilight, how are you here, Rear? <laughs> and I remember I was watching it with Corey, and we just about died when that happened. Oh my god. I, can I mention really quickly, I, I, this is absolutely insane how lucky I'm getting with these, these like, cave mounts. How, how much farther away am I? 4,000 blocks. Oh, is that all? Hmm. Oh, Lord. I'll probably be done after that. I got to hook my mind on there. Good God, that does not look right at all. <laughs> that looks very, um... What's the word? Oh, wrong. <laughs> this looks like... This looks like Nintendo 64 graphics. And honestly, you know, I kind of like it for that. What is that purple thing? It's a big old purple thing up there. What is that? Probably a tree. Oh my god. It's probably one of the uh, Archwood logs from Ars Nouveau. Or is it Nou Nouveau, right? Ars Nouveau? I, can't, I don't know if I'm saying the word correctly. It's the French word for new. That looks terrifying. <laughs> that looks like my graphics card is just about to light on fire. Oh, that's right. Yeah, there's those little sky islands that it spawns, too. Yeah, they have. Sometimes they have, like, ores and stuff in them. I see copper up there. Sometimes you get really lucky and there's, like, emeralds or diamonds up there. Setting the stage for a hero's parade. <clears throat> oh yeah, somebody actually mentioned, uh, asked me about Sonic Heroes earlier in the stream. Wow, that is... It, like, that is like simultaneously cool and terrifying. Again, it's just like the way that it just like... It minimizes the way that the blocks look. It's just like, I don't know, it's kind of freaky. <clears throat> That is so weird looking. It looks like everything's made out of wool. Oh, oh, 
wait, 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 what is this? Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god! That's... Okay. That's one way to get off the boat. Yeah, you just stay there. I'm gonna be honest, I forgot he was with me. Um... Let's go to the beach. Each, let's go get away. I am looking for <clears throat> tropical gardens, which would have soy bins, which I need to sprightly. What is that? Oh my god, it's another one of those villas. <laughs> it's like when you set the LOD distance something lower than the developers intended. Yes. Yes, indeed. I don't see any over there. And I don't see any over here. But can I see some over here? Can can we like will them into existence? Can we can we make it happen? Can we summon forth all of our energies and good vibes and holy crap another waystone? And good f feels and stuff. Uh, you know what? Mm, I wonder if I should just leave this here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it here. Chromid. Um. Yeah. Let's not call it chromid. Let's call it. Um. Let's call it each each. Let's go get away. <laughs> Another classic song. Yep. El Classico. I remember when it was brand new. And um, we joined a TF2 server. And it had like a, a jukebox mod or something on it. And it would like say, you know, oh hey, now playing this song. And it was, it was now playing Nicki Minaj Starships. But... I'm gonna skip this. Oh. But, um... For whatever reason, I guess maybe we didn't like download the audio files or whatever for you know that server's mod, so we literally were not hearing the song at all while it was playing. So me being what was this like 2010 when that song came out? Being 2010 or 2011 me, um, can, can we get a can we get a timeout on that person? Um, being 2011 me, I, I joked that this, that the lyrics for the song went starships in my butthole. And once again, they thought that was hilarious. Excuse me! Excuse me. No! Also, wait a minute, this is actually a good, good question. Can I moderate from here? don't think so? Can I do slash command? Timeout? Okay. Yeah, that's totally what I wanted. Thank you. <laughs> what the heck? Um, well, that's kind of upsetting. I can I can add to block list and restream chat, but I can't like moderate. Unless wait, can I? I just clicked on this. What how do, what does that do? Oh, I think. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, now I think I can do it. Sign. Um, I don't think that went through. Okay. <laughs> So let's do this the hard way. Cause I just I, I don't know if anybody actually did time them out. And if I'm like I'm just still seeing it or if he's not actually. Cause I, I just want to see how how this works, really. Oh 
Okay, well, this isn't lagging at all. Well, the last thing that I'm seeing is Webkin saying 2012-ish. Okay, so now... Now they're timed out, but it's not, like, making it disappear on this chat that I can read. So, whatever. I guess that's just how it works. <clears throat> um, this is awkward. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, that was normal. <laughs> that was totally normal. Thank you for that. <laughs> um... Oh dear. Uh, I guess I gotta. Man, I guess I gotta hoof it from here. Yeah, let's make on, on sit, and then uh, run. We're running, 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 running. You know, speaking of, of Pikmin, there was actually a mod that I had that I don't think has been updated to 120 yet, called Mystical World. And, God, I wish it would get updated ASAP, because it includes modded animals, um, including reindeer. And they're so cute. They have, like, these little stick legs that just don't bend. And they, like, when they walk around, they walk around really slow, but their, like, their little legs are going, like, like this, but they're moving so slowly. It's so, oh my god, it's adorable. Bees! I see bees. I love bees. But, um... Also, Mystical World adds these little entities called Sprouts. And they look... Li they literally look like Pikmin. <laughs> there's like a... There's a green one, there's a red one, and a purple one, I believe. And if you kill them, you get, um, like, food from them. I think the yellow one gives you, like, wheat. The red one gives you tomato? And then the, the purple one gives you an aubergine. Okay, let's see how much we can swim here. It's, uh, okay, kind of just... Oh, okay, wait a minute. Yeah, kind of have you sit, and then push you in there. And then boop, boop, boop. Here we go. All right, sweet. Uh, you're with me, right? All right, perfect. Here we go. Oh, great. Now we're going back to the stupid ice area. <sighs> This ice area smells. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Everyone caught in the struggle. Do 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 do. I do wonder if there's ever going to be another Smash game. I, I mean, I, I I can see it both ways, honestly. It's kind of the reason why I'm like so uncertain about it. Because you know, if another Smash game comes out, it's going to sell. 50 billion units and it's going to make Nintendo an absolute boatload of money. Oh, goody, I get to wait until this loads again. Um, it's going to make them a boatload of money. But at the same time, God, Sakurai was like, I mean, you could literally see how exhausted he was. So, and I, I don't know if he has another one in him. Although, to be fair, I mean, he doesn't really have to be, like, the head guy, you know, doing it. He, he could be, like, you know, like, an executive producer or whatever. Oh, my God, that was actually kind of terrifying lag. I thought my computer just froze. <clears throat> he could be, like, an, an advisor, or like, executive producer or whatever. Um, or, like, creative advisor, creative consultant, that's what I was thinking of. Because I know Miyamoto did that with some Mario games... Which I can't think of off the top of my head right now. <laughs> he wants to retire before he makes another Smash. <laughs> I mean, it is... If it ends up being the last Smash game, that would be sad. But it is also a an absolutely fantastic send-off. Oh, Which, I mean, that thought process is weird to me, too, because Smash 1 came out in 98. Then Melee came out in 2001. 
Brawl came out in 2007. No, it was supposed to come out in 2007. It came out in 2008. So that was 01 to 08. Smash 4 came out in 2014. So that was 08 to 14. And then Ultimate came out in 18. So that was 14 to 18. So that was only a four-year gap. But then again, Smash 4 was not very good. I, I will... I, I will say easily it was the like the weakest of the series, and it did not help that they split it up over two different platforms. That was kind of stupid. I mean, I can't say I'm surprised. Dragonite <laughs> sold as many units as all the other ones put combined. I am not surprised. It, it, it it's a fantastic game. They did a tremendous job. Um, advertising it, <clears throat> hyping it up, and it was a very good game. It, it was it sold very well. It was a very good game. Is he? He's not sitting, right? He shouldn't be sitting. No, maybe he is sitting. Can you? Oh God. Uh oh. I don't like this setup. I don't like this setup. Oh, okay, God. I thought he just <laughs> I turned around. He's not there. He's like, oh no, he drowned. Is he sitting? Yeah, okay, now he's not sitting. Okay, good. That kind of freaked me out. I was like, bro, I brought you over 3,000 blocks away. Please do not just drown randomly. Also, God, this was this was part of the uh, conversation that I had with Dak the other day about Sonic Heroes when we were talking about the remake coming out. I, I said this was probably my favorite level in the game, was the Haunted Mansion. Where you go upside down. Oh my god. Like, I just... I The, the music, I love this song. The, like, the level design just felt good. It felt like a fantastic level design. And, then like, the going upside down part, that was that was fun. That was, like, innovative. Hey, Skensy. Glad to see you're back. Your Mario Galaxy 2 playthrough was my introduction to Let's Plays and YouTube in general. The channel... Hold a special plate in my heart, as well as ABTZ comms. That's a, uh, yeah, that's, again, it, it blows my mind every time somebody remembers a ABTZ comms. Because it just, it hasn't been touched in ages, you know? It's it's just, it's funny to me, you know? And it, it, was a, it was a fun project, but not a project that we stuck with for very long. It made like it made sense to us on paper, but then the execution of it was just like it was a little bit more hassle than I think we anticipated. Especially because like we were trying to get all four of us, obviously, into the commentary, and at that time, um, Zero was in college, and he had spent a lot of time, you know, doing. You know, projects and studying and you know doing work for school and, and you know going to school and stuff um, but yeah was it two playthroughs I swear I only remember the one Super Mario Galaxy where we kind of took turns and then oh my god is that what I think it is under the damn ice yes it is good lord I hate I hate it 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 um, and then we did like some Mario Kart Wii stuff but I think like it was like time and Oh, Timon had stopped uploading Mario Kart Wii on his channel, and then he... Oh! And then he said, you know what, let me do, like, a... A, um, a redux of it, but on ABTZ comms. No, I don't have space for this. This is the... Oh, Rare Ice, that's what it's called. Yeah, there's a mod called Rare Ice, where you can just, like, find stuff in the ice. Yeah, there's a diamond in there. Do I care that much about one diamond? Earthbound. Well, I mean, Earthbound was on my channel, so I don't really count that. It was, you know, and, and I'll say this probably to the day I die, was Earthbound was had to have been the most creative playthrough that I ever came up with. You know, naming each of the four characters after us, and then when each of the characters came into the game, that's when that person came into the commentary. So, obviously, Brian was around for a heckin' long time. Timon was around for a while. And then... 
Oh god, and then there was the, and then there was the point when Brian gets kidnapped. So then it was just me and Timon for a little while. <laughs> Timon, you know, it was it was a little rough, I'm not gonna lie, with Timon as the co-commentator because he didn't know anything about Earthbound. He never played it. I don't think he knew anything about it. Oh more rare eyes. I don't think he knew anything about it. I, I don't even think I don't even know if like the genre was like his jam. There was a, a point when we were in Threed, when it was still taken over by zombies, and I think Time Man had come. Time, <laughs> Time Man had come home from work, and you know we said, "Okay, okay, yeah, hey, we can do the commentary now." And Time Man literally fell asleep during the commentary. <laughs> he was he was falling asleep. I mean, I can't blame him, you know, he works for UPS and, you know, that's a demanding job physically, but like, man, that was just kind of hilarious, but also kind of, you know, unprofessional, I guess you could say, but he like literally fell asleep when we're trying to do this, you know, commentary. It was like the hardest thing, the hardest part for me was just like, I wanted like, I wanted all of them to be as excited about the game as I was, and like as excited about the playthrough as I was, and I think Timon was like lukewarm on it at, at best, and, and Zero was like, what's happening? <laughs> <clears throat> Zero was like so confused, like so many, at so many different points. Especially, I think the very first time the Fuzzy Pickles guy popped up, and like Zero, like you can audibly hear Zero go like, "What? What is this?" I think I was thinking about Zero the other day too. I was thinking about like the last time I ever had him in a video was like when I did that Mario Kart 8 video, and like I, I got the band back together. And yeah, we did like that one last video. I think that's that's the last time like he was ever in a YouTube video because he deleted his YouTube channel like way down the line. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Yes, that's yeah. That that was. Oh my god, now I don't have a shop. Okay, this parrot is a bro. <laughs> he's he's willing to suffer it out with me. Oh no! No, no, no. Hey, like, I, I, he took damage because I hit him, right? Not because of the freezing, right? Uh, I'm really scared right now. Parrot teleports me. Parrot teleports me. Oh my god. Jeez, he's at 1 HP. I have to be really careful here, I think. <clears throat> um, but yeah, that was, that was the most shocking thing. Like, when he told me that he had a daughter, I was just like, what? Now I feel old. Oh god. Now, now I feel like, you know, when, when I was a little kid and, you know, I'd go to, like, family dinners and stuff and, you know, you'd have, like, all the all the adults, you know, all, like, gathered around and, you know, talking about the old days and stuff. That's what I felt like. I felt like, you know, here's, here's the four of us, you know, we're all, like, standing around, you know, grilling, grilling hot dogs and steaks and, you know, having a beer together and just being like, yeah, I got a kid now. I don't know how old she is, though. I, oh god, I can't remember how old she was when we did a commentary. And then it'd be plus whatever years that was since then. Oh god. I want to say she was one when we did the commentary. So she's probably like at least like at least seven now. Seven or eight? God. Crazy. Oh, Parrot. Wait, parrot, don't move, don't move, don't move. No, sit, parrot. 
Alright. What's happening? What is he doing? Why why is he doing that? What is going on? What is happening? I did not bring you 4,000 blocks away for you to just glitch out like this. Okay. Good. Just sit right there. Do not move. Please. Oh, Lord. Yeah, stay nice nice and close to the fire so you stay nice and warm. Oh. I'll say this is another DJ Max uh, song. Holy moly, that was a huge trip. <laughs> That was a ginormous trip. Oh. Okay. Let's put all this stuff away. Uh, let's see. It's kind of boop 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 Okay. I'm just kind of uh mob drops, mob drops, mob drops. Mob drops, I guess. Drops, 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 drops. That's not drops. I used to parrot sit for one of my mom's friends. This is about how easy it is to get that. <laughs> I can imagine. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I need to upgrade my chests. Oh, man. Heck. Fly in the freedom. Oh, sweet. I already had the iron in there, so I'm just gonna let that cook. Let him cook! Sort that out. Boom, bam. Um, I guess I'll just put this in here for now. <clears throat> oh, true. Gotta, I gotta waste stone my stuff here. Home. All right, now we got a waystone. Hooray! Oh my god, I'm making myself like hooray! Snow golem, we have a waystone! Hooray! Oh my god. No, hey! You better get back outside, mister. This is not your room. Mm -mm, no. No, we're not having this. Uh-uh. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. You go back outside. There we go. Go to your room. <laughs> God, that guy's rude. By myself. Um, you know what? Let me put this in the rare stuff. Actually, no. I'm gonna keep this in my backpack. <clears throat> this can go in the rare stuff. Blocks. Blocks again, I guess. This is food. God, I love how fast I filled up on food on a double chest. <laughs> My god, this is crazy. When a happy life or a dream. Good lord, I do not have the space for this. I, 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 I really need to upgrade these chests. Actually, wait a minute, here... I, yeah, I was gonna say, I have some of this stuff already. Blend it in as much as I can, and then I needed that terra <clears throat> I needed that terracotta so that I could um make kitchen kitchen stuff. I guess I'll just put this in here, this in here, this 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 this, and then this 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 this. this. No, not that. <laughs> that 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 that, and then that. And this. And okay. I think we're good. Okay. How's my iron doing? Almost there. Alright. So I think... I think, I think I took a stink. After all of this. I think that's going to be it. <clears throat> for the stream. Holy crap, it's been four hours now. <laughs> Last time I checked it was two and a half. Now it's four hours. Alrighty. So while this is cooking, mm. any last questions, any last words or anything? Oh, by the way, Space Ghost, coast to coast. It's awesome. <laughs> okay, Dr. Zeus Hall. 
And then I love how I, I'm the one that said, why do I know you to that? <laughs> when I'm the one who initially said, I think, I think I took a stink. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Dragonite has a very important question. Why is there a D in fridge, but not in refrigerator? You just hit me with a, a logic paradox. My brain broke. <clears throat> That's probably why refrigerator is so like frequently misspelled. I never really thought about that. Cause you would you would imagine that refrigerator has a D in it, because fridge does. Huh. You know what? Google it. I, I'm I'm not the the, the question answering person. I don't just answer questions. God. Uh, what do you think I am? A question answering person? Unbelievable. It's not safe to bow her off here, Anthony. Are you sure about that? I don't know. It seems a little, a little dangerous to me. You know, before I go, I'm going to see... Oh, God. What is it called again? It's got a different name now. It's not... It's not called Rainbow Island, or Rainbow Hills, it's called something else. Oh, Rural Garden, that's it. Oh, I found one! Oh, Poggers! Okay, so that's what I'm doing next. All right. Oh, so I think, I'm just gonna save and quit. I'm gonna switch this back to this. <laughs> <clears throat> oh boy, look at all those things dancing around. Boop, 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 boop. All right, sweet. All right, so um, yeah, that is gonna be it for this stream. I hope you guys had fun, like I did. Um, it was a very one of those comfy streams. When I, when I pull the shirt... Oh, I thought you guys could see more of the shirt when I did that. Oh, whoops. I guess I have to stand up. There we go. There's there's the guy. The guy I was talking about. But, um... Yeah, I think that's gonna be it for this playthrough stream. <laughs> wow, my brain just, like, short-circuited there. Oh, no! My, uh, my coaster. My mushroom coaster. Why is it so blurry? It's a mushroom. And it's a coaster! Look at that. It's got the Nintendo seal of quality and everything. And now look at this. I didn't even sip water for the last four hours. I should probably do that. And I got this one too. A one-up coaster. <clears throat> uh, yes, I did I did a couple of playthroughs as a stream. I did a Super Mario Bros. 1 and then the Lost... Yeah, th yeah, the Lost Levels. I, I had to think about that for a second. I was like, wait, did I actually do that? Yes, yes I did. Alrighty, so that's going to be it. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me. And, uh, oh yeah, you should have done that. You should have hydrated me. <laughs> Alrighty, so that's going to be it. Thank you all so much for hanging out and uh, being awesome. Thank you all so much for um, all the generosity today. That was really fantastic. I, I'm so blown away. Um, thank you. Thank you so much, everybody. I really, really appreciate it. And it, honestly, I, I appreciate everybody for just being here. You know, just at the at the bare minimum. Just, just being here. Love you guys. Thank you so much. I will see you all next time.